Hello everyone, it's Catmore, and we are going live on Jurassic Cherno. I wanted to give this a try again, because the last time I was here, I was having terrible connectivity problems, and I'm hoping that's a thing of the past. So far so good, I've been able to stay connected for a few minutes, so I'm happy about that. And I've already encountered one dino, and took him out, so I know that that's working. So now we're just at the spawn area, and I'm trying to load up with stuff, any and all stuff. I'm trying to get uh, any gear I can find, any extra ammo I can find. Um, I don't want that. Oh, it's a flashlight. I did just find a bison, but it doesn't have a mag. We're gonna just clear out these things as best we can, as quietly as we can. Now there aren't any, um, I wonder what that's like. There aren't any huh, NVGs on here. Or we weren't gifted them, put it that way. Now why can't I wear that? Um, combat visor. Oh, you have to put it on the combat helmet. Okay. Hi, Badger. Oh, there's the helmet. Okay. Oh, wow, I look cool. Does it interfere with my view at all? Does not. Cool. Now my head is protected. Boy, I look cool. <laughs> well, we have uh, had a little bit of a funny day in terms of uh, connectivity issues, and so I came on here hoping I could stay connected. Um and kill some things to take out my st my frustrations on something steam uh steam reloaded about five times i i have no idea why what's going on i don't know if anybody else has been having trouble with steam but uh, i have been since the 1.21 drop i've been having hello, 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 hello. interesting trouble staying connected hi samurai bread I hope everybody's having a great Memorial Day who's American and anybody else who might be celebrating a holiday. Uh, let's see. I have only seen one of the little gliders that run around here and I killed it. Uh, earlier, I shot at one and my bullet didn't hit it. Um, so I shot it about 800 more times and none of my bullets were hitting it. So that uh, made me think I might be desynced a little. So I tried to restart, and uh, an hour and 45 minutes later, through six five or six different Steam validation launches, etc., etc., I finally got to I could kill a dinosaur. Uh, oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. I hate migraines. I've only ever had two in my life, thank God. And I just, I feel so much for people who do have them regularly. So I hope that clears quickly and that the sound of gunfire won't set you off. Um, this is Jurassic Cherno by Muddy Waters. Whoa! Shit! Oh my god, that was scary. And, uh, I've played on here before, twice. It was a lot of fun. It's very hard to stay alive. Gosh darn, it's very hard to get down a flight of stairs, apparently. Um, and... I want to get quietly out of this area. Now you do get a map that comes with your um, with your game. All the red areas are um, v PVP areas. It also tends to be where the bigger, nastier dinosaurs are. I'm over here on Scalisti. There is a bridge though. And if I zoom in, you can see where I am in comparison to the bridge. The bridge goes that away. Uh, so I need to get from here to there without getting eaten. And it's not as easy as it might seem. And also, I like to loot these areas around the map where there is more stuff. Because you're going to need stuff, especially medical stuff. And I believe there's a, there is a medical um, center over in this end of the island. So the trick is to get where you're going quietly with as little killing as possible. And especially with as little... Um, attracting of attention 
That was what worked for me the last time. So you don't want to fire your weapon any more than you have to. Uh, but you need to get out of here. And here's the little guy I killed. So there's the little um, flared guys, little green flared guys. Now I am very surprised that more have not come upon me because I did shoot the one and typically that means that you're going to attract attention. So I'm going to try to make it out to those stands. In this game, in this particular uh, iteration, it's all about getting one step closer to, from safety to safety, especially when you're solo. If you had uh, four or five people to cover things, uh, you could probably make it faster, but um, it's I haven't seen these gates before, so I'm not sure if that meant that that was safer. But uh, if you if you attract a uh, triceratops when you're in the open, um, you're in trouble because they will run right through you, right through the building that you're standing on, and uh, knock the crap out of you. So I'm trying to. If you hear a big rumble in the distance, it's time to boogie. Um, and I also only have one thing of food, so that's a crisis too, that's a concern. So first things first, we're going to try and see if there's any ammo or guns up on top of these things. I don't see anything there. We're going to try to sneak down the alleyway here just as quickly as possible. We do not want to go to the other castle because that's where a large dinosaur. Oh, there's some food. Good. That's where the Triceratops hangs out, so it would probably be better to go on down the road than it would be to go down that way. we got some good stuff on here. Uh, oh, that's good. Um, this rider jacket is really cool. It's got 30 slots, but I don't believe it's going to be as uh, protective. I may be wrong. Um... And I did switch out the main plate carrier for a lighter modular chest rig. Hi, Dizzy. Yeah, it seems to be for now. I did shut down my uh, modem and, and um, um, router and restarted everything. Uh, there we go. Thank you for the coming on in, guys. So I'm hoping for the best. And I'm trying to... Oh, boy, I'm starting to get the chain of disconnection again. So I'm trying to decide whether I should take the uh, rider jet. Oh, yep, there we go. So restarting the router, the computer, and the modem has not protected me from these. We'll see how it goes. If I keep getting booted off, then I'm going to have to give up for tonight. It's been a very frustrating day from a Steam perspective. I have days where I play without any trouble at all, and then all of a sudden this will start and it will not stop, so I have no idea why it does this. Can't figure out the common theme here. So we'll knock on wood. Alright, so, again, my theory is the leather jacket gives you better blood protection, bleeding protection. So I'm thinking... That this might be a better idea because I don't want to bleed. I only have so much to go around. <laughs> All right, and uh, I was surprised at this um, the lighter weight um, chest rig gives you quite a lot more uh, storage space than the the um, plate carrier, but a lot less protection. So I decided to go with a more uh, storage lighter protection because in the past when I played this server I had a lot of trouble moving fast uh, once you get loaded up with stuff because you get so heavy um, so I wanted to see if I couldn't take care of that now here I'm going to look at real quick at the map excuse me for a sec because I need to know which way those little I think it there right here yeah, I'm here, so I want to go to the right, I believe. I'm not 
check up here for anything. Need medical stuff, need food. Well, it is when you're facing large dinosaurs. I mean, it does protect you. Uh, it gives you some um, coverage for injury, against injury. But it's so heavy that it, it kind of, I'm not sure whether it outweighs the val validity of it. So we'll find out in a little while if I'm still alive. And I'm going to just, um, I have to decide what to pick up and what not to, but right now I'm just going to collect anything I can. Keep hearing weird noises, I don't know. Bonsoir. Oh, hi, Sammy. Just one moment and I'll get you a shout out. For YouTubes. Get into a building where I... I am very surprised I haven't seen any more of the... Um, oh, there they are. I spoke. Actually, that's good because I was kind of wondering whether the server was working. There they are. So now... Okay, we switch to semi-auto. We don't need to hit that guy with three shots. And that's going to attract attention. Yeah, there we go. There's attention. There we go. One shot will do. And uh, once those guys start on you, they never stop. The whole time you're on the island, anytime they come up on you, they never stop. They just keep coming. Let's see. <laughs> well, what we just uh, kind of discovered with the noise level was, um, let's see. I go that way. I came from that way, didn't I? I think so. I can't remember. I think so. Yeah, I came from that way. And my memories for shit, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> Now, I can get up on one of these things, and I think... Oh, hey. Alright. We got an extra one. I don't know if that means somebody died and it just spawned there, or if, uh... If I just found a... Oh, ooh, good. I mean, you'd be pretty safe up here. Um, from the biggies. But, uh, come on. Let me pick that up, please. Um, alright, so now I've got the bison that I picked up. Where's that other big gun that I... Maybe that was a bison I saw. Let me see. I don't think so. I picked that up in the... So, oh! Did I drop my gun? I didn't think I did. So where did the other one go? Huh. I don't know. Where... That's weird. I didn't think I dropped my gun, but there, but my gun was just lying there on the ground when I picked it up. I've got it in my hands. All right, something might be a little bit weird. Let me go back here and just make sure. This was the second one I went to. Make sure I didn't leave anything important behind, because I'm not sure why that happened. I have had, an, on occasion, um, stuff just drop right out of my hand, and I don't know why that is. So the, 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 um, orange sky is, uh, the, uh oh shit, yep, that's a big one. be a um, triceratops. You don't want to be caught in the open by those suckers. Oh yeah. Holy crap. I think I dropped it? Hmm. Oh, oh no, it's not a triceratops. It's a red one. Redhead. Yeah, they're big and they're, they're, they're tough to kill. 
boy, they are sure make a lot of noise. And the trouble is I can't get a good shot on it from up here. Is there another room with a better view? I don't think so. There, maybe I can get him there. <laughs> oh boy. I ticked him off, that's for sure. <laughs> go. There he is. <laughs> Burst. Alright, he's down. That'll bring a lot of attention though that I really didn't want. Oh, there's a little guy. I'll switch back to uh, semi-auto. <gasps> There we go, pick that guy off. Alright, now you can cut them up, and they do give you a steak or so, but uh, it's not a really good a good bargain, because uh, for every one you kill, that's how many respawn. Or how many you cut up. There we go. So it's a good idea to leave them as is. Right now I'm going to go run down the hill. Now I haven't usually encountered the redheads on this map, on this part of the map yet. So they may have changed the spawns. So that's very exciting. Oh, there we go. There's a map. I don't know that I need it, but I'm going to take it just for now. <laughs> Taking out all, every bullet I find. Oh, here they come again. And they will cut you to ribbons, so you need to get uh, undercover or somewhere where you can have your back to them. Because um, before you know it, they're like wolves. They will cut you up. They'll cut you up, man! And they come in twos, threes, fours. Oh, thank you. Yep, we need to hydrate in the game and in real life. Alright, so we did not s loot in here yet. So we're safe in the buildings relatively, unless a big one comes and then they kind of glitch through the wall. Well, aren't they cute? They're really cute little guys. We're just going to pick up all the ammo that God gives and then we'll sort it out later. Uh, I don't think I need to have a match. I mean, uh, I could use some more uh, bandages. So first I'm going to just put this away and get a little bite to eat. Okay. Oh, that's what happened. I picked up a... Th uh, I did pick up a second one. I didn't drop it. I picked up a second one. So I can't put one down because I have one in my... Um, I'm going to throw out the bison because I don't have any ammo for it. I do have some ammo for it, but I don't have a mag. There we go. That's what happened. Boy, that was weird. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this sucker up. I do have an extra knife I found on the floor. Get some rags going. Hi, Frank 2. Thank you very much. I'm going to get the hydrate in just one second. I'm going to uh, eat my beans. I have a canteen, too. A very, it's a very fun server to play, guys. I, I, but there's a big difference between playing it with four or five people and playing it as a solo. As solo, it's it's got to be more strategy than brute force. And uh, what's worked for me in the past on here a couple of times now is to um, tread very carefully. Now it's not the most exciting. Uh, stream <laughs> components than it is, you know, blasting away, but um, blasting away is a short lived life. Usually. <coughs> Hello. <coughs> can, I, can I punch him to death? I think I can. That'd be quieter. They are Dillamixaurus.
They die easy, but they come in numbers. And they trap you in doorways. I do have a fair amount of ammo on this on this uh, server. You you start with a boatload of ammo, which is pretty damn cool. Cause you'll need it. All right, so we're gonna go down here first. And like I said, you just run like hell from one place to another. Get back in in a place of safety as quickly as you can. And I'm just gonna run this way first, and then come back down the other way. There's the well there. So I'm going to get a good drink <coughs> and refill my um, my coffers, so to speak, <laughs> as I just finished coughing. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, I'm going to take a sip of my... Oh gosh, I, I guys, I have to recommend a, mm -hmm. a Bolt, Bolt Farms Vanilla Chai. It is really good. I saw it was on sale and I got some for my mom. And I dilute it for myself because it's too uh, too kind of thick for me. If that makes sense. So I dilute it and it's just, it's delicious. It's delicious. And it's not too expensive. It's about $6.99 or $7.99 or so for this giant bottle. And if you dilute it, then you get like twice as much per bottle. So that's not that expensive of a treat. And oh boy, I love it. It has a cool um, cardamom flavor, you know, that Shy has. I don't know if other people know about cardamom, but it's really good. It's a tasty, inexpensive treat that also hydrates. Well, that's good. Oh, here come more. Okay, let's get on down the road here. Now, what I'm looking for is just um, food and bandages, stuff like that, because um, you get cut to ribbons. So, oh, jeez. On this, you can get cut to ribbons. So you need to have a plan, and extra bandages are handy. They do start you with... Um, Disinfectant, which is super nice of them. Buddy, come here. I try to hit him with one bullet, but sometimes I can manage it, sometimes I can't. And again, oh, there's another one. <laughs> they just keep coming. And sometimes their pale triceratops comes with them. Well, and sometimes a raptor. I think that's a raptor that just made that sound. The eee! Raptors are super quick and uh, super persistent. I'm not sure what they're modeled after in the reg regular game, but boy, they're tough. So what I'm trying to do is, um, yeah, lean and aim. Brad, I'm not very good at that, so this is a good opportunity for me to practice. It's a very good idea. I'm going to try to practice the skills I'm going to need. Um, I wanted to get on the masks because I'm going to be, uh, <laughs> if you can believe it, I'm bodyguarding Josh for his event. And uh, I don't know the mask very well at all, only from what I've watched. So I'm just going to stick with the group, try not to shoot the group, <laughs> and have a good time because that sounds like fun. And I was really very pleased that he invited me. That was so nice of him. Because I'm sure there are very many better people he could have chosen. Okay, where are you, you little bastard? He might be on top of a building or in a building. They are fast. Fast as fuck, boy! Now, they won't go in the water beyond a certain point, so you can... Oh, there he is. As a last dodge. Oop, where the heck is my gun? As a last dodge, you can jump in the water. Right. Yeah, 
that's the noise the raptors make. Oh. Yeah, and they one tap you. So I might be done for the day. <laughs> I'll have to start over again. Gosh, I should have known better that they could get up on there too. Yeah, those ones you need to shoot from a safe distance because they are vicious. And they're very strong. They're little, but they're they're very strong. I don't know if I'm going to survive this or not. I might just turn over it back at the beginning. Yeah, yeah. I knew that too. But uh, I thought I'd give it a sh I thought I could hit him. Um, but unfortunately, my aim was not that good. I don't know. I th I've been aiming pretty well. Okay. Let's see. Hey, he didn't cut me. What, what do you know? That's a miracle. Where's my gun? Where is my gun? Oh, there it is. Can I give you back my gun? Alright, now let's get off of here. That's amazing that he left me alone. Kind of sinister. I can't remember if I stopped here or not. Oh, yeah, I did. Useless. Can you imagine shooting a dinosaur with a rubber slug? I don't know why he didn't kill me. That's a, that's a first for me. Oh, you know what it is? It's the, it's the leather jacket. That's what it is. Oh, and the helmet. I put on this crazy helmet. And the leather jacket uh, prevents blood damage. So I think I made a very good choice, you guys. I really do. I think that's what saved me just now from a stupid decision. Alright, so there's boats all along here and I would like to check for stuff. And it seems to move kind of quick. Okay. Don't need a crowbar. Oh, that's uh, chlorine. I need that. Why can't I? Oh, there we go. Alright, now I can purify water. Excellent. Let's get in here real quick. Oh, lots of wellies. There's a scope. A flag. Oh, I forgot. Um, you're allowed to base build on here, if you can believe it. And there are drivable vehicles on here. So this is a really fun server. It's just very deadly. Uh, uh oh, something big coming. I heard it, but I didn't see it. Anybody see it? Could be the raptor again. Could be something bigger. I don't know. Well, here's one of the backpacks. They come, uh, these pristine ones, they have all kinds of attachments. Um, compact military, and then you have a belt, a combat belt. So if you can find uh, stuff to put on there. Uh, you also get the chest rig, can carry pouches and uh, modular pouches. I'm not sure what those are. But I did fee f get this molly panel. Um, does anybody know what that's for? Where does that go? Because I've never seen that before. And I don't know what it does. Tactical belt. Okay. Oh! Oh, it went on there. But what does it do? What did it do? Turn me around. What does it do? Capable of storing up to four grenades or a number of 40 millimeter. Oh, okay, here we go or 40 millimeter rounds. Huh, that's interesting. I picked that up off the ground. I didn't even know what it was. Um, all right. That's cool. Hi, Fresh C. Hi, underdogs. Welcome in. At underdogs. As usual, folks, if you can go ahead and follow each other. Uh, and don't forget, Sammy's on YouTubes. So you have to go out there to his, and I'll just, I'll just repeat that, uh, Shout out for him for the new folks. And uh, does a fantastic job out there. As does 
Fresh Seed has a wonderful server, you guys, Viral, and it's Deer Isle, and that is a really fun server as well. So please do go out and follow everybody, and if you can, uh, and you'd like to get out there to Viral Deer Isle, it is a lot of fun. It's tough to survive, but when you can make it, man, it feels good. All right, let's see. What? To, where can I get to next? I've never been out on that dock. I don't think it gains me anything. Oh, there's the medical that I wanted to get to. Um, I don't think there's anything up at the... any point to going up to the lighthouse. It's weird lighting on here today. Not sure what that's all about. Alright, we made it. We made it! Now let's see if there's anything here to grab. Do, do, do. I got the Jurassic theme park going through my head again. Yeah, and um, the little guys. What's the dog doing? Oh, hello. The little guys are. Um, they don't glitch through the walls that much. They will glitch through a door every so often, but the raptors glitch through walls. So you gotta kind of try and kill them as soon as you can. Unlike me, getting knocked over by them. Oh, that reminds me. It's not the Z beatdown, but I'm going to call it that. Because it was a, a denizen of the server. Well, thank you, Bizkit. I appreciate you following. That's very kind of you. Um, we are attempting to get off this island, if we can. If I can remember which way to go. But there's nothing in this uh, medical facility at all, so that's kind of disappointing. Oh, wait, I spoke too soon. An empty first aid pouch. Yep. That's not so helpful. But, we will go ahead and put our rags in there to protect them. And our bandage. Um, oh, and that reminds me. I better go ahead and... Make sure I uh, disinfect these. I got beat. I got knocked unconscious by a gosh darn velociraptor. But that's not that uncommon. All right, we'll store that in there in my rider jacket. Oh, excuse me. I've been picking up all this extra ammo, but you do come if you'd like to try this server. I, um, the gun that you get is a G3, and it comes with. One, two, three extra mag, or two extra mags plus the 100 mag that you have in it. And then I found another one. No, three extra mags, and I found an extra one. So I've got four. So I've got 400, 500 uh, bullets. Plus I picked up an extra gun. So actually I've got, unless I missed my guess, I've actually got 600. So let's put that one on there. Oh, that must have been the one I had on there in the first place. All right, there we go. Now they're both on. They're both loaded. I picked up a gun off of the off the um, walkway, and it was another G3. They're both pristine, and so that's a pretty handy dang thing. And it's got 83 bullets. That's the one I have been firing. Let's check the other one. See how many it's got. It's got 53. So I'm going to go ahead. Somebody must have died. Probably got into it with one of those redheads or the triceratops there and dropped their gun, and I found it. So I'm going to load her back up, make sure we're going into this with, <coughs> excuse me, as much armament as possible. But this is kind of a disappointing first aid stop. It does take a little while to load that many bullets, I'll tell you. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Oh, they're back. <coughs> Excuse me. Gosh. Now I'm going to get a little something. I don't think I ate all that food, did I? Did I eat all of my food? I did. Alright, so I'm going to eat a Gorky bar before I go out there. One thing I'm trying to do is uh, to prevent myself from getting a cold because any noise at all is bad news around these guys. 
and I don't want to um, be ill because I when I could have picked up a, a Zagorky bar and eaten it. But I don't have much food, that's for sure. Alright, let's see. Now let's look at the map real quick. We're on Scalisti. We're down here. Um, it does not show a lot of detail. You do have your water tap. There are some buildings over here I haven't been to yet. But the place I want to go to get off the island is up on this end somewhere around in here. I can't remember where. But there are hunter cabins all the way around that coast that I would like to stop at. You just It's a its a question of risk. And up at this end there's a, a bunch of hunter cabins as well. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to sneak along the coast and try to get over there. I'm going to hit that house there. I think we've hit uh, this castle here we want to avoid like the plague because there are some... well that's not the one. That's the one we started from but this one over here we definitely want to avoid, even though there's a pub there and it seems like a great idea. There's a, a tyran um, not a Tyrannosaurus, a, a Triceratops that lives there. And uh, he ain't so easy to kill. I think I want to go. Wish I could aim better. <coughs> He's not bothering me right now, but he'll be back. Okay, I've been to all these houses. I don't want to go up there. But I do want to go up this way. To this end. Because there are... Oh, there's one. Am I going to get cornered? I'm going to get cornered. I'm gonna get down here. They do pop out of the water uh, every so often. If you shoot them in the ass, I've seen that it works best. Uh, that's a, the most effective way where to hit them. Their hitbox seems to be something to do with their ass. I don't know why. Uh, I think I went the wrong way. Pretty sure I did. Yep. Now I'm not going to cut them up or try to eat them, guys, because I am pretty darn sure I went the wrong way. Gosh darn it. I get so turned around on here. Because though it shows you where you are on the map, it doesn't show you... Um... No, I'm going the right way. That's, that's a little something up there. I don't know what that is. Let's go up and see. I thought that was a castle. But I don't think it is. Oh no, it's a, a ruin. Okay, good. We are going the right way. Phew. Because, uh... I get so turned around so easily. I don't know how what it is. No sense of direction whatsoever. Don't want rubber slugs. Now, there's a wrench. For some reason, I spawned with a wrench, and I don't know what it's for. I assume it must be for the motorcycles or something. I know there's drivable cars. Um, there, I'm going to take that baseball bat and make it my um, primary melee. I like a baseball bat. And sometimes it's really handy to just beat the little f effers to death. Rather than actually... Ugh, jeez, I got stuck again. Is that stupid? I get stuck behind the doors on these things. Alright, now we need to get up there. Make that run as fast as we can. Try not to get caught in the open by anything. I don't know what happened to that raptor. Oh, hello. Um... I don't, they don't usually attack you once and then wander off. That was weird. Not sure 
why that happened, but I'll take it. There's some alcohol. I might pick up a shoddy at some point. I'm not sure. <coughs> Hello, you little bastard. Yeah. No, I'm not super good at hip firing, so I'm going to practice that today. The other good thing would be to get all these doors open so that when you run back through if you're being chased, <laughs> it's quicker to get inside. Boy, they are quick though. There he is. That was weird. Alright, so we're just gonna try and Check all these places. Oh, hey there. That's what I was looking for. I was hoping. Okay, this is a single barreled shotgun, but I, I don't think I'm going to take it because I did find that extra um, high powered rifle that took up the spot where I might normally have kept one of those. Where'd he go? He's down there somewhere. Gosh, they're so quick it's hard to hit them. There we go. Got you, you little booger. Okay, now I'm gonna pill. gonna try and grab everything I can that uh, is edible now if I can find anything edible that's what a problem on this island <coughs> is food all right now I think we want to go out this way to the end of the island where there's the hunter shacks keep trying to find something to eat and I did find one can of food so that's good got a better helmet pick up any I don't have a Mosin I'm not likely to get one but there they are now I did get hit by a triceratops out here once but that was after I had made quite a lot of noise before I figured out that you needed to go a little quieter. Um, a couple of times I have actually encountered bear traps out here, so that was a little surprising. <laughs> Unfortunate. Well, I've already got a map. I don't even think I need a map. I don't think I'm going to go with a shoddy. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of the shoddy ammo. Because I got that second gun, that really made a big difference in strategizing. Try that lean. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, I'm all about that. I have to coordinate a lot of movements. <clears throat> There's more of them. There's one. There are a couple of different kinds. Yeah, you can hit them in the head. It doesn't seem to kill them. The butt shot's the best. Now, see, I've got a gas tank there, but because I picked up that extra mag, I don't have a lot of room for a uh, gas tank and nothing to cook because I don't want to kill the, um, I don't want to kill the dinos for food because then just more spawn. But this is helping me. I'm trying to use this as a, a picking off uh, practice. Hello. off practice, hip firing practice, the things that I need practice on. I thought maybe this would be a good place to come to do that. Where'd he go? Ah, 
One I got. Wow, there's a lot of fall through on this map. trouble guessing where the bullets are going to go. Because I'm a lousy shot no matter what I aim at. <laughs> okay, now we got another canteen. Do I have room for it? Um, I will if I move some stuff around. I don't think I really need the map. I'll look at that in a minute. These things stack up pretty high, so that's handy. So you can stack things higher than you normally can. Oh, there, now I can pick that extra canteen up. That gives me a little bit more freedom, so I can get back to the well. Not going to pick up any shotgun shells, but I am going to take a look at this map and see if it gives me anything I don't already have. Oops. I don't think so. Yeah, it doesn't it doesn't give any more details, I don't think. Oh yeah, it does give some more detail actually. A little bit. Well no. Doesn't really. Alright, so we've been up here. That's that ruin. Um no, this is the ruin. That's the castle we started in. We've been over here. We've been around here. We need to get over here. And all along this shore there are um um Hunter cabins, and I want to see those. So let's go ahead and let go get down the shore. I think we've been to all of these. Maybe not this last one. The door is still shut, so let's just go in here real quick. I was really glad to find those gun cleaning kits. Oh, hey, there's a scope. I don't have a gun I'm going to need it for, but I might find a. If I find a um, tundra, will that go on a tundra? I think it will. And here's another canteen, so let's see if I can figure out how to pack another canteen on here. Do they go on this thing? Nope. Do they go on the belt? I don't think so. Nope. So it has to go in somewhere. Let's put that down for a sec. There we go. I think we can get both of those on. So the one on my belt is got regular good water in it, and the two in my um, in my luggage do not. So I can stop back by the well if I can find it, or I can find some fresh water and purify it. Now I'm going to run down this coast, and again, you want to get down close to the water so that if you come under attack, you can get in the water. That's my my strategy. It's worked pretty well. Um, if something big hits you, like these little fuckers come from behind. Son of a bitch. And he's already got me bleeding. Son of a gun. Come on, get that away. Alright. Ah, shit. Where's my bandage? Where the fuck is my bandage, guys? Did I put it in here? I did. Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, shit! What the hell? Okay. There we go. Alright, now. Back to... Moving on down the coast. Yeah, they hit you hard and they hit you fast. Most times they do give you a poor, fair warning though. They do that peep peep noise before they hit you. 
there's where I'm going, is around that end. There is a, um... Another big castle up here. And like I said, it's very dangerous. There's a hub in it. Has some good stuff. But there is a... There's a Triceratops that lives in that general area. And I, I couldn't tell you whether it's worth the danger to go in there looking. Because you just get cut to ribbons in there. And uh, we went in there with four people, and three people came out. And then we had to go back and wait for the person to respawn and come back down to meet us by the big gate. So, I don't know. It, 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 you know, probably if you had more people in your party, it would be a better risk ratio. But for one person, I don't think it's that good of, uh, worth, it, worth it to risk it. I keep hearing very low pitched moaning kind of noise and I think that's the triceratops so he takes a lot of shots so avoidance is good because you just use up a lot of bullets and you don't get anything out of it other than killing a triceratops which is admittedly kind of fun but <coughs> I did find a fish hook so that's good and I've got a piece of paper to start a fire I've got a hundred of those bullets. We'll just stop at that point with those. I don't have anything to shoot for them. <coughs> okay, let's see. Can we see them out the window? Not so far. At least two of them, I can hear them. There's three of them all together. There's always at least two. In this case, I think there are three. Jesus Christ, he's so fast. And I can't... There we go. Shit, he's already cut me. Yep, this is why you need the the bandages. God damn it, I thought I put that on the gosh darn. Where is my bandage now? Holy crap, guys. That's taking too long to take care of stuff. I'm already yellow blood because of my slowness in response. It's just driving me crazy. And that's one of the reasons why I wanted a medical because I I know I need more bullet or more bandages because I'm just too slow. It drives me crazy sometimes. I know there's another one out here. So I'm gonna run for the coast. Luckily, I think uh, knock on wood, but I think our issue with the getting bumped off every few seconds is stopped, so that's not gonna- oh. oh shit! God damn it. God, he broke my thing and he turned on again. Come on! The fuck? Just put the damn bandage. And now he's hit me in the ankle. Oh, two bleeds. Oh, gosh, you guys. This is not going so well. <laughs> Come on, don't go unconscious. Jeez, and there goes up my bandages. So, now we are going to do this in a very precarious position. Oh, I know what's wrong. I can't put it on my bar because I didn't have it in my possession. Jesus. All right, now we're stuck with the super slow bandages because there wasn't any bandages in the hospital. So we, we need to get somewhere off this island quickly where we can get to a medical and get some more bandages. But the last time this happened, I believe it was all the way, I had to run all the way to Selichny before I could find a hospital. I'm hoping that won't be the case this time, but it's possible. Yeah, 
I'm just not I'm just not quick enough. Alright, so there's the mainland. And when we come around this corner, we'll see that there are um, there's a big bridge. But all along this coast there are these uh, hunter cabins. There's the bridge. Alright. Now we've already had an uh, experience with a red-headed uh, dinosaur. Those are cool. They're really cool looking. There's another thermos. You know what I think I'm going to do? This probably makes more sense. Is I'm going to take the one I like the best and I'm going to pour these others into it. Oh yeah, and if you notice that, gas max is only for toxic zones, so you do not need to have a uh, full um, NBC gear. So that is really cool. So if you, you know, it's definitely fun to get on here and try this. Um, it is very difficult, but I'll tell you what, it's worth it. Really, it's really fun. And now let's see, I'm going to pour this in here. Now I'll have three or close to three that are, let's see, this is pristine, 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 okay, good. Everything's pristine and they're all purified. So now I can run for as long as I need to with no water. <coughs> the only problem is um, I need food. So that's one of the reasons why you get off this island as quickly as you can because there is no food out here, um, very little anyway. I got this one. Good, it's lunch meat, not cat food. I'm gonna eat this up. Once you're on the mainland, you find food, but out here on the island, it's pretty scarce. So a lot of people are tempted to start killing and eating the uh, dinosaurs, but it's not a super good idea. All right, I'm gonna save some for later. I'm gonna get rid of that. Move my fish hook up there so that I can pick up this flashlight because I don't have NVGs. Um, when we first started on this server you, you spawned in with NVGs which was pretty darn handy I must say. But you don't anymore. So maybe they thought that was a little too easy. Alright so there you are you little bastard. <laughs> Oh, damn bad. There we go. All right. And like I said, um, oh look guys, there's a chicken. Oh boy, I'm tempted. But I don't have any way to cook them. I certainly don't want to drag that kind of attention out here. Okay, so we've got two gun cleaning kits. All of your guns spawn in pristine, all of your mags spawn in pristine. So you probably don't need three gun cleaning kits and probably don't even need two. So I'll hang on to two. I was kind of hoping I would uh, run into a few more of the um, military um, pouches and things, but probably I'd need to go out. I probably needed to go up to that castle for that. Uh, I don't have room for a chicken. Although I would really like to. I just don't want to take a chance on dying up there. I tried going up this back way and uh, I got mobbed. So, I mean, I can think it over on the way over here to the island. Check the island. Sometimes you find some good shit on there. But there's another backpack. So somebody else got this far and then crapped out. And that's what I think that means. It is, it's um, very challenging <laughs> to get very far. Oh, hey, look, there's bolts. Oh, there must be crossbows on here. That's, how much space do they take up? I think four. Yep, four, okay. Let's think about that for a minute. 
I think I'm going to go ahead and rewind before I get onto the bridge. I mean, re, uh, re, uh, reload. Once you get across this bridge onto the mainland, all, all, all is fair in love and war. If you stay near the water and go around the outside edge until you can find transport or get better bandaging and all that kind of stuff, then you're... I did pretty well going up to Slichny, but it's a long-ass walk up that coast. Um, I'm trying to think whether or not I could go, go a little faster to the west instead and go along the western coast. Um, that might be a quicker way to go. Okay, let's make sure everything's loaded. That one's loaded. This one's loaded. Okay, everything's loaded. And we have um, still got almost 400 bullets that are free. And then we've also got 1, 2, 3, 4, 80, 100. So about 500 bullets left outside of the mags. Not too bad. We're doing all right. I might get rid of this uh, hunting scope if I need the extra mag. Um, I'll put a gun cleaning kit on here, might as well. I'll put a thermos on here, might as well, just in case I need it quick. Um, can't think of why you would need a wrench. I'm still trying to think about that. But I think it's because if you flip over on a motorcycle, then you need to flip yourself back right right side up. Now this is going to be tricky because I don't know how dark it gets on here. I do have a flashlight, but then I can I won't be able to carry a weapon. That's going to be tricky, tricky indeed. All right, so what we could do. I just make a run for the bridge. Okay, one more canteen. I can't see these guys in the dark. They can follow me out onto the bridge. So that's not a perfect solution. Uh, I can't remember how to get around here. can't even see them. Oh, that worked. I can't remember how to get out onto here. Oh, let's go around it, duh. There's a dead one. Yeah, it gets pretty dark out here. There is a solution. There is a, a little uh, place off the side. I don't think I've ever found anything in one of these places. Let me get you guys gamma. Hopefully you can see better than I can. Boy, if that's gamma. Can you guys see at all? I'll try it again. I wonder if I had it on before. It is pitch black out here. Does that make it any better for you guys? Is it dark? I'm gonna light a flare and set it down. I think I'm gonna have to. I found a lighter. I've actually got two lighters now, so I think we're gonna do that. We're gonna light a flare so that we can actually see what's going on. There we go. A little bit better than no light at all. Kind of mini, it's going pretty well. I'm still alive. I do have yellow blood because I got the shit crap kicked out of me by the little uh, what you call these? Uh, what do you call those guys? The um, Mexorus is Phila Phila Mexorus or something like that. 
but I'm going okay. I'm going to go ahead and take those out of there. Oh darn, can't combine them with those ones because those are tracers. All right, so we're just uh, running around out here on the dock on the way to the mainland. I'm going to take a peek and see if that gamma is any better for you than it is for me. No, that's about the same. I'm going back and try it again. All right, now, let me see. why but gamma is not working guys I can't I can't make it any brighter for you sorry about that thank you for coming on in Lepo. and thank you for raiding I appreciate that thank you for bringing your folks we are in the pitch dark here on Jurassic Cherno so I'm a uh, I'm a uh, just taking my time a little bit because it is darker and dark there we go get you a shout out so I dropped this flare to make it as bright as I could, but um, for one reason or another, I'm not sure why, gamma isn't working. Okay, now we're going to try again, because I think I know why it didn't work. All right now, hopefully this will be better. A little bit better for you guys. Yeah, that looks better. Yep, now it's working. Alright. So, well, let's put this down. Pick this sucker up. Up here. I don't think I, I don't think you get anything different. I don't think they actually they do follow you onto the bridge, but I don't think they spawn on the bridge. So we'll go over here to the second little uh, offside, and um, hopefully we won't get chased by them. And this is a way up onto the top part of the bridge. We came onto the bottom part of the bridge. I don't think you can get anything out here, but I thought we might as well check. Yeah, I don't think so. But up there is where we want to also check everything. We came onto the bridge from the bottom. I also want to go over there and check that uh, before we do that go up. I want to make sure we check everything down here. Because I don't think uh, that they chase you out onto the bridge. Uh, they'll, they'll come to the beginning of it, but they won't walk all the way out here. At least it doesn't seem like they do. <gasps> Alright. Well, that was a pretty short night, so that's good to know. Alrighty. Outside M21 light. A tactical flashlight attachable to rifles. Ooh. Oh, hey, we might have our problem solved here. Uh, let's put that down. Let's go ahead and try putting this on our rifle. Will that go on there? Nope. Not on this one. Well, ship. Well, shoot, shoot, shoot. Is it worth taking? How big is it? Um, well, well, we'll we'll keep it for a little while. If we don't need it, we'll get rid of it. Not finding too many good things here. Okay, so this is a military radio pack. That would be really helpful if you had a, a team. Oh. Does welcome in. Hi, Rampage. Silence. Thank you for the raid. I appreciate that. And I'm going to get everybody a shout out here while I'm relatively safe. Get one bad soldier, and we'll get silence. Thank you guys for coming in. I appreciate it. I'm just uh, trying not to get killed by the uh, by the dinosaurs here. And as you can tell from my vision, um, I'm not succeeding as well as you would hope. <laughs> oh boy. I didn't do too bad, but I'm just not very quick. Yeah. 
I'm not as quick as I need to be. And boy, they don't uh, they don't uh, cut you any slack. I'll, they they cut you, but they don't cut you any slack. How's that? <laughs> All right. I think we got. I think we got everybody covered there. If I've missed anybody, please let me know. And I think we can um, go ahead and look at gamma getting getting rid of gamma now. Now that it's working, let's just double check that and make sure it's not still too dark for you. It'll just take a sec. There, that's not too bad. Okay, good. All right. So over here is where we're going. Just a short hop, skip, and a jump away. That's the mainland. And let's look at our map. We are here, halfway across this bridge. And then uh, scope out a little bit. See, Kami Shovo is pretty close. Um, I did go up here to these houses. And then it's a long haul up the shore to Selichny. But there is a hospital at Selichny. And I don't think there is a hospital at Kami Shovo. It's a police, but not a hospital. So I was thinking more about bandages. But if we can get to uh, Kami Shovo, we can get down to Electro. And there's a big hospital there. And I think it's going to be a better direction to go than Selichny. So we'll, I think we'll take that chance. Oh yeah, it's fun. It's really fun. There, it's it's uh, very challenging, that's for sure. But the nice thing is you get these on, on Jurassic Cherno, Muddy Waters Jurassic Cherno is where I am. You get these really cool G3s. You get a boatload of, of bullets that come. You get, I think you get three extra mags of 100 plus some bullets. And I found an extra gun and uh, it came with a full mag. And then I found an extra mag too, so i am actually got somewhere close to six or seven hundred bullets. So that's a really good thing. And then up here, at the end of the um, bridge, there's a big old gate. Now you can just jump down from this level, but I did want to run back up to those stairs and go upstairs and uh, see if I can move those cars because um, definitely the uh, food is the crisis on this map. The hardest part is staying fed. Now once you get up here, you can encounter dinosaurs. They do come out on the bridge. Actually, they, come, they came after me below too, so that was exciting. But only just because they came out. Oh, cool. That would be very scary in real life, but that was fun. We're hanging out over the abyss. Yeah, so that's the castle I did not go to. What the dog do? What the dog do? Well, thank you for the follow, Rev. I appreciate that very much, Rev Den. Um, I did not go up to that castle because uh, the last time I did, there was a very unfriendly tri Triceratops up there, and I did not want to meet him again. Uh, let's check our boots. On here, you definitely want to check your boots regularly because you run a lot. And the last time I came off this bridge, I went up to Kamishovo and I saw a car sitting there, so I stole it. Uh, I don't know whose it was. I'm, I'm sorry if it was you. <laughs> but, oh, good night. Night silence, and thank you so much for bringing your raid in. I appreciate it. You have a great evening, and for those who are celebrating Memorial Day, I hope you've had a great one. Little boogers. There's no food. And I don't know if somebody else has come through and, and scarfed it all up, or if it just isn't here. Okay, so there's kind of a... do have a... Oh, hey, there we go. Oh my gosh, that's a lucky find. It's huge, though. Oh, we gotta f we gotta take it though. Let's get rid of our extra wrench and this thingy, which I'm not sure. It's a extra light though. We'll keep it. But I think we've got two wrenches. I've got one already. Boy, that looked like it moved as I was running up to it. Oh, that makes me nervous. Makes you feel like, you know, there's some huge dinosaur walking nearby. Which is entirely possible here. Alright, so we're leaving this place. Bye bye. We're hitting the road. Getting off Scalisti. 
on this lovely bridge they provided for us to run away on. <laughs> and I think I will try to go to Cami Shovel. First we'll probably hit the houses right around the base. Now we have the tack back. Um, we're not nearly as pressed for food. In fact, I will stop real quick and eat up the rest of the of the lunch meat since I know I don't have to, to worry too much about food right now. So those of you familiar with Cherneris, um, we're at the southeastern corner of the map. There are places up to the right that go up the coast to the east, up the eastern coast to the north, rather. And then there's a whole western component to the map. There's also inland. I have not dared to, to go straight inland because... Um, I, don't think I, I don't think I've... Lo oh, look at that, gosh. I haven't dared go straight inland because... Um, huh. I guess I can't order, open that. Oh, there we go. Forgot. That was the front. Because when you're inland... Um, and you don't have, if you have big stretches of open land with no houses, no cars, no nothing, there's nothing to get up on, there's nothing to fire from. It's like going in and getting attacked by wolves in the hinterlands. You just get cut to ribbons. And uh, so I did, I did go in from Selichny inland and I did okay. But that, that road in from Selichny into the interior that has a lot of little towns and little places to hide and uh, things like that. So I think if I were going to do that, I would want... Oh yeah. Alright. There he is. It's another one of the red ones. Let me take him out now. Let's get this to... burst. Back to semi-auto. All right, because we would have gotten attacked by that one the minute we got off the bridge. They're big, and there is stuff up in these uh, towers, so it's worth it's worth taking a gander. And you really you really just need to take advantage of all the food that you find. Stay up on your food. Stay up on your hydration. Because as soon as you start sniffing, sneezing or coughing, you can't hide at all from the uh, dinosaurs. They hear you immediately. We got into that with, uh, when we played one time, uh, somebody who shall remain nameless fed us human meat. And so we could not stay quiet. And we got absolutely slaughtered. And it was very disappointing. I'm like, man. Okay, so this is, you think, oh good, look, it's a wonderful door, it's blocking them all out, and then you come over here and realize, oh look, they changed it. This is interesting. They've changed this, that is cool. Because what happened before was, you got up on the um, that wall, didn't come all the way over here and they could just walk up the ramp behind the wall and come right onto the bridge. So that's funny. They must have decided to change it. Because see there's a stairwell over there. Oh, I think they took the stairwell away too. Interesting. Interesting. Let's go over there and see if we can see it. Yeah, there was a stairwell down over here. They've taken it all away. So now the dinosaurs cannot get to you unless you go through the big red door. Well, that makes a lot more sense to me. Because I was like, well, what, what's the point of a big door if you have a, a walkway right up onto the... <laughs> so they've redesigned that. That's very, very funny. Oh, there's a guy waiting for me right outside there. Shoot him through there. Let's try the lean. Think I can get him? 
I got him. I got him. The lean worked. Ha ha. Oh, there's another one down on the ground. Can I get him? Let's try that again. Where is he? Oh, there's another one up here. Yep, I got him. Oh, maybe that... Oh, you know what? I bet the stairs are still there. They're just outside the wall now, rather than inside the wall. That's funny. Now, one reason why you might want to not open the door and go down the other way is because I don't know if it makes a big old noise to let everybody know that you're... How do you activate it? Oh, there we go. Yeah, it does a da 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 Okay, so this is where the bridge used to, the the ramp used to come up here. So that's cool. They, they did change that then. Oh, here's the stairs that I was talking about. So these came right up onto the walkway here. And they could just come right up and bite you. Whoa. Where'd he go? Huh. I can't quite figure out where this... Where the, um sight is pointing. There we go. Alright, now let's get down off of here before the more more come. Alright, so now we're on the mainland and you want to check all these crates if you can. If you're not going to get uh, chased because they are as good stuff. But they will come right up the ladder after you. Alright, and you got lots of crates. Oh, that's a scary thing coming down. I think there's six crates all together. Uh, that's worth checking. Um, there's a USG 43. Or 45, excuse me. So now I have to decide what do I get rid of to take that. I'm going to drink my soda while I'm thinking about it. My blood's coming back up. Any day now, I should be able to see color. Um, let's see. What do we want to get rid of? I've got two of these guys. We can get rid of one of those. Yeah, it gives me chills to throw out a lighter. But, and here's a 10 round. I think we're going to go ahead and just get our ma our um, bullets out of there and leave the mag because a 10 round doesn't do you much good on against a dinosaur. That would be a rude awakening. Alright, so then we can take our guy back. Same here, 20 rounder. Let's just go ahead and take our bullets out. This is a fun server though. I've been having a really good time. I wish I hadn't gotten so slow uh, to uh, get my bandages in the right place at first, but we'll do better. We'll do better. Alright, now let's see. Let's go ahead and open this now so that we have it ready for when we need it. That was a great find. Oh, it's tech back for sure. And I've got one more water. I've got plenty of water. And we're doing alright on the bullets, I think. Let's just check our load. Yeah, we've got plenty. So we'll stick with the number two gun. Alright. Let's go check our other... Where is he? There he is. 
They do that little pause before they attack, so that does give you a chance. I am really slow today for some reason. I'm not controlling my hands that well. Apologize. A little bit, uh, like, geez, Pete. Oh, another backpack. Okay. Whoa! Shit. Shit. Scare the living but Jesus out of you. Shit. And then they kill you. They bleed. Make you bleed. Come on. Pick up freaking bandage. Oh, I was just getting to where I was getting my vision back. And these bandages take so freaking long. There we go. Alright, back to... Alright. What was I... Oh, it was just a backpack. Yeah. And these guys have some stuff. Or they did, uh, last time I was here, they did have some good supplies on top of these green things. Well, that's a good thing, actually. Can that go on my current helmet? Oh, I don't think so. Can you put that on there? Nope. Well, well, we'll hang on to it for now. It won't go on the gun, either. There seem to be a dearth of solutions for making your, uh... Okay, now if I recall correctly, this one I had trouble getting up on, and I don't know why. Yep, same thing. Seems like you had to stand at it from just the right angle. There we go. Do 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 do. Um, Heckler cock hand guard. Oh, that's going to help me tell the two guns apart. One's got the tan and one's got the black. I think they're both pristine, so... Yeah. That's going to be helpful. This one's the one I've been shooting the most, so it's got the fewest bullets. Okay, now we're going to get back over here and check these other crates. Another pair of boots. Uh... I've got assault boots, pristine high, pristine best, but you can't carry your knife in one. So we're sticking with the one that you can carry your knife in. Got two or three more. Huh. There's nothing in here. Well, what a ripoff, man. That one's locked from that end, but not this end. What's that? Boy, this is decidedly not very good loot. <coughs> Another USG-45 mag. That's two I've got. Neither one of them is full, but close to it. And I don't have the gun. But. Let's see. Do I want to carry two? Well, yeah, let's get rid of this. Well, we will to carry two, because that would be a great secondary gun if I ever. If I can get a bigger backpack. This, this backpack that you come with, it's super. Uh, but it only has 50 spots. So if you can find a mountain backpack or a military backpack, then you can drop this one and go with the, the other. Uh, you're better off. There we go. What are you doing, doggo? Alright, so now we're going to try... I think we checked all these things. Oh, good thing we didn't jump down quite yet. Oh yeah. Not sure what I'm stuck on. Oh, I'm stuck. Okay, what was that all about? I am stuck on the very edge of this crate somehow. Okay. I heard a 
bigger thing. Oh, hey, our blood's gone up. Yay! Alright, so, um, Kemi Shovo's that away. But there are some houses right along the shore here that might have some good loot. Um, the only thing is, I don't have any room left. But it'd be a good idea to check for food. And to get the shortest distance between houses and safety. Oh shit, that's a big one for sure. Uh, where is he? He's over there. The Triceratops. That's not one you want to screw around with. See him over there? Can you see him? I, I'm, my vision being what it is. Oh, there's one of the little guys coming. <gasps> I hit him. I didn't kill him. He's going to come up that other ladder. So I'm actually on the wrong side here. Because he can't get up here. So he'll come over here. Guaranteed. I'm trying to think whether or not the Triceratops could possibly get up here. I don't think so. <laughs> so <coughs> I don't know if that was that same one or not. I want to get to that house down there to check for stuff. But I don't want to get... Ah, oh, he's right below me. So can I get him here? I don't know if I can shoot him there or not. Did I get him? I think I got him. Wow. Alright, so the Triceratops is over there. They're extremely sensitive to hearing. There's another one. Jeez, these things are relentless. Alright. The Triceratops seems to have wandered off into the forest. That's good. Or not. I don't know if it's my vision or what. I can't see that far. It seems particularly poor, um, wait, do I still have gamma turned on? Do you guys have the same vision I do, or, oh no, it's the same. Okay. Hi, Maddie G. I'm doing pretty well. Let me get you a shout out here. I am trying to make a decision on whether to go right when there's a triceratops right down there, or to run left. I think we're going left. I don't think we're going to gain enough from that house or two that's down that way to make it worth the danger of uh, getting hit by that Triceratops. We're going to head for Kamishovo. Getting on top of a car will help with a Triceratops, though. Even though they're big, uh, but they might still be able to hit you. So it'd be better if you can get in somewhere. Oh, another canteen. Boy, they are canteen rich on here. We made it. Phew, our first sojourn off the island, guys. We're still alive. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, let's see, the rotten tomato. That's so helpful. Um... Alright, next. What's the next thing we're aiming for? This is a long stretch. Let me see. Alright, so. We got the map. We're here. We have a long run here. So our best bet is to go down by the water, I think. And run along the water so that we can dip into the... Uh, water and fight them from a position of strength. 
because I don't think it's going to make a lot of sense to, uh, yeah, they're coming, they, 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 they just clip you everywhere. You get down to the water, at least you can back into the water. Oh, there they are. They just hit me. Yeah, they hit you and, uh, kind of, you stumble a little bit. But they can't come in the water. Or they don't like to. And it doesn't really affect your health all that much, as long as you can get back out pretty quick. So, it's worth a dip in the water to... Wow, this sky is weird. They've changed a few things. That wasn't like that before. It was just like a normal Cherno sky. So they have changed a few things. And I keep hearing that Triceratops rumble. The nice thing about coming along the shore is you can check these boats. I did miss some boats. Here it comes again. There's a little fucker. Man, they're quick. I know I keep saying that, but it startles you every time you try to fight them and they just, they come up on you so fast. They move so fast. I'm not really good at aiming. Uh, that's one thing that I came on here to, to do is to practice uh, hip firing and quick aim because those are not my strengths. So, oh, thank you very much, Maddie G. That is so generous of you. Very much appreciated. Gosh. Oh, you guys. I'm loving the chat for Mr. Maddie G. So, so helpful to streamers. Uh, all kinds of us. Let me do that. Stop here and get some love in there for you. You're so generous and I appreciate it so much. There we go. Ugh. Oh. Now, I, I wish the, that I could figure out what's wrong with the um, alerts, so that I get alerted. I did hear an alert, but um, it's supposed to say that you gave a donation in the... Let me just check and see if it does. Does it say up above in chat? Because I don't see the same version of chat that you guys say, but does it say that Maddie g has been... Um, that he's uh, given us, let me see, gosh darn it, I wish I could figure that out, I've got, to, I still have to, I still have to speak with um, Chimney to get that fixed, because he's told me he can help me with it, so I apologize that that's not fixed yet, because that's annoying, okay, so out here, they can come out here, and they are on this island, but I think it's worth a look. I thought it was my vision uh, because I had yellow blood that was causing everything to be kind of washed out, but I actually think it's the it's the server. Yeah, that's what I got too, but it didn't do the alert as far as I know. So uh, I'll talk to Chimmy. We were supposed to do that last week, but I got uh, I'm in preparation for surgery next this coming Friday, so I got a little bit distracted from doing what I ought to do. So, oh, a gun cleaning kit, so that would be super. <coughs> well, thank you for the gift to rep down. You guys are so super. That alert, did that came in, I heard that, did you hear that? So, yeah, it's the tip alert. And I've fixed it twice already, and it just doesn't seem to like my fix, so I'll get with, uh, with Chimney and get that settled. Why? And also my alerts are, some of them are coming in twice, so obviously there's some stuff to fix. And I don't really know whether there's any really good stuff out here or not. I've, I have come out to search it. You know, I don't think there was last time I was here, is my crawl. I went around these these little sheds, and I didn't actually find anything, I don't think. I'll give it a gander. 
Oh, I take that back. A battery's super handy. That's worth the trip just right there. Ooh, you got the rotating ones. Those are my favorite. That and the cat burglar. That striker made me. I think are my two most favorite emotes. I've got to get back to the emotes too. When you're a streamer, boy, there's a lot of stuff to pay attention to, I'll tell you. I know, Maddie G, you're probably in the same boat. So, so much stuff to do. And one of the things is to keep up to date on your emotes and make sure that they look good and everything functions right. And that's one thing I really have to get back to. Because um, I did them myself, some of them, and, and I like them. But um, they didn't turn out as professional <laughs> as I would like. Because I'm not a professional. They come out looking kind of juvenile. Like a little kid did them. Which isn't true, but fairly close. <laughs> uh, now I look at them and I go, oh man, they aren't very good. It, if that'll work for you, I think that'll work, yeah. Um, Maddie G and I are thinking about streaming together on Thursday. And that'll be my last chance to stream before I have surgery, so I thought that would be a really nice way to cheer myself up. And that sounds good to me. Alright, there is a rope. That would make it possible for me to fish, so we're bye-bye, Mr. Hunting Scope. I love you, but we need to be able to feed ourselves. So there we go. Now we are set. That was a good find. Um, I don't know if there's anything up in this windmill, but I don't know about you. I want to see if you can get up there. Can you get up in that? Looks like you can. Oh, cool. I've never been in here, I don't think. Oh, wow. Oh, this is really cool. Wouldn't you love to live in here? Wouldn't that be cool? Oh, I'd love to live in a windmill. It might get kind of noisy, but I suppose you can um, stop the blade from going around. What's that? Okay, there's some kind of a... Oh, that must be where the flower comes out. Let me see. Because they're supposed to be grinders, right? Yeah, they're grist mills. Basically. You pour in your grain and... Oh, wow, there's another way... To... Oh, this is so cool. Look at that. I didn't know this was all up here. Caution. All right. Yeah. I don't really care what map we do, uh, Maddie G, if you want to think about it. Um, I, I tried to get on the mouse today, but it was so full. I mean, there are so many people. The, and I don't want to spend like an hour in queue. So, oh, this is really cool, guys. Look at this. I wish I could get back far enough to get a good photo of this. It's pretty slick. Oh, that's better. The best I can do there. Really cool looking. You can see how it would all work too. That's really neat. This thing around I'm hunched under is like a one one of the cogs. And then the uh that arm goes out to the to the windmill. Oh, it's pretty slick. All right. It looks like there's a balcony. I wonder how you get out there. Oh, there's a door. Oh, duh. Oh man, this would be the best place to live ever. Can you imagine? You could lock the blade so it didn't turn in like a storm. They must have a way to keep it from turning. So only turn when you want to generate like power. But imagine. You have this great veranda. You're up off the ground so that you can easily defend yourself. This would be terrific. Really, really a very great, good place for a base. Oh, 
I know they're down there. I just can't see them. They're probably underneath me. Because I'm on the balcony. Oh, I really like this. There'd be a lot of room, too. This would, I think this would be, this is probably, other than the church, this might be my favorite idea for a place to have a base. Look, because you've got multiple floors to defend. The only thing you'd really have to worry about is some idiot uh, trying to burn you out. Because that would not be good. Yeah. I'll take the floor with a balcony. Absolutely. You could fish off the off the balcony, maybe, or I don't know if you could fish off of this floor. Oh, there you are, you little bastard. Try my lean. Fire from a lean. Hello. You'd like to come closer? Come here. Come here. Here, Rover. Go to whoop whoop. Go to whoop whoop. Oh, there I can lean. Oh, I can get over here a little bit more. And I can shoot him right through the window. I actually don't have to lean. Okay, that was one of them. Go to whoop whoop. They go. Look at this, you even have vegetables growing right through your floor. I'll bet you could plant a garden under here and you could have food growing inside your house. That would be f that would be really cool. All right. Enough putzing around. Putzing around. Exploring is my favorite part of this whole game. All right, so we're pretty close now. That's uh where we're headed. I'm trying to think what's the closest I can get to. I think... Yeah. It is definitely Chernarus with a twist. Um, and I do know Chernarus better now than I did when I played this the first time. Why did I make that funny noise? Oh, oh, it's the new... Yeah, the very important 1.21 where you now groan when you step off of six inch curb. Because, you know, I don't know if there's anything important over on that island, but I want to get somewhere where I can get in if I have to. Alright. We made it. Well, we're almost there. Ooh, Sarani. There's a B. I don't know if there's anybody else on here tonight or not, but you're not supposed to shoot each other in the PVE areas. So one would hope that if oh that's a that's a um that's a what you call him? Yeah, that's a raptor. This isn't the best strategy. Yeah, I thought. It does look like Chimsy. Oh, thank you for the in-game mic. No wonder they're finding me. I'm talking away. <laughs> okay, we can beat the raptor to a house. That's a better plan because you got windows to shoot through. Barns are not a good place to try and uh, fight off a raptor. Best place to fight off a raptor from though is the top of a car, in my opinion because you have a good field of fire, they can't get you, and you're just like inches above the... So easy to... they can't get in underneath you basically is what I'm saying. So that would be a good place to be over there. Get up on here. Not the best place to be to get up from a Triceratops, but... There, see how little they are for all the noise they make? They make a lot of noise, and they're very powerful. 
Uh oh. What just happened? Oh, Daisy just crashed, guys. Uh, just one second and I'll get back in. Sorry about that, right in the heat of the moment. That doesn't happen too often. not getting in. Hang on a minute, guys. Was it a... Oh, no, I don't think it was. Hang on, we're going to relaunch the, the launcher. I don't think it was a, a server restart because it was a two hours and Eight minutes the last time I looked. That was that was a, that was a little while ago, so it's possible. Just one moment while we get back in. I apologize for that. At least that hasn't happened all evening like it has on other times. I hope that's not a sign of times to come. Just in the middle of our raptor fight. I'm a little worried that when we get back in. The raptor will have been... Well, actually, if he disappears, that'd be all right with me. As long as he isn't replaced with something bigger. Or more aggressive. Yeah, Muddy Waters also has, if you like the, the Jurassic one, but you want louder noise and more stress, <laughs> he has a really cool uh, server called Techno. And in that you fight, um, oh good, he is gone. You fight all kinds of uh, robots. And let me tell you, boy. Yeah, see, time until restarts, one hour and two minutes. That's what I thought. But that means the, for some reason, the, um, the raptor hide off, so that's okay. Hopefully he won't come back. But luckily, raptors are very polite in always announcing themselves. And this is a really good server too because the fruit drops. So you can survive on fruit. So it's a good idea to check when you first get into an area. It might not drop at first, but after a little while, um, it should start. It may take a few minutes for it to for the fruit to start dropping. It's a pretty juttery. Feels like um, it's a little bit shaky. That might be why it shut down. Okay, we got some seven six two three nines. Not too shabby, and we're gonna eat our apple. There we go. Don't have to cook it, but. Um, I've made it all the way around Cherneros and uh, Deer Isle, both, on servers where fruit drops, just eating fruit. So it's, uh, it's a really handy feature. Alright. Oh, here he comes. And the raptor and the little put up ups Okay, so we're going to go out this door and jump on that car. There he is. Put up, pup. I should shoot your butt. I shoot you in your butt. All right, we had an apple. All of our stats are going in the right direction. Uh huh, uh huh. I have not tried Serrani yet, you guys. Has anybody here tried Serrani? Or Luke's? I want to try them both. But uh, I haven't had a chance to try either one of those yet. Ooh, I saw food. Yes. Well, um, now, let me ask you. Uh, I've had it said that Serrani is a very dry and... But still a lot of fun. You just have to be prepared that there's not a lot of water and stuff. 
um, well, looks is very luscious and green, lots of uh, vegetation and stuff like that. So different reasons, uh, both are great, but for different reasons. Does that sound like a, how you would assess it? Or is there something in particular about one or the other that you liked? Ooh, some more 76239s. And since I haven't played either one, I really don't have anything to compare to. But um, I'd like to. Oh, wow. There's a. S We're going to have to take that in. We have to fit that in somehow. So, we've got one sewing kit already. We've got some alcohol tincture, so I think I'm going to have to give up this iodine. Or we could give up the universal flashlight, except that's so handy if and when you get a helmet you can put it on. Um, I could get rid of the Colt mag. That would probably be the best thing to get rid of. So I'm not going to pick up a Colt. There we got some 45s. So I can refill my uh, my USG 45 mags. That's cool. Actually, I'll just top them off. Yeah, well that is amazing that you did that well because uh, those little suckers I'm, I'm that that that's that speaks well of your skill set there because um Man, Sanctuary, the only problem I have is I cannot stay connected to that server to save my life. I keep getting bumped off, but I'm having a thought that maybe it's a general problem with my with my ping and it's not the server itself. I think that might be a that might be the truth right there. All right, so we don't have a place for Let's see. Yes, we do. These ones are going to go with the others. Why they don't stack. There we go. We'll put those with there. And there we go. Everything fits. It's Ms. Tetris. Tetris. Oh, you do crash when you're on there? Oh, okay. Um, that, that's, I'm, I'm not happy about that, but I'm glad that you, uh, that you mentioned that because... Oh, well, that's where they went. Okay. Let's see if they all fit in the same stack. How many can we stack? Well, at least 36. There's 22 of these. Um, yeah. Let's put those in there. I think what I'm going to do is cut up that... Where'd it go? There. Cut up the skirt. And make it into... A rags. So that I have two full stacks, because until I get to that hospital, I am very vulnerable. Alrighty, let's see. Do I have six all together now? Nope. So I'm not going to disinfect till I have six, unless I really need to. These ones are disinfected, so there we go. I don't know how prone you are to infection on here. I have not actually survived long enough to get sick. <laughs> I did survive for a couple of hours one time. Okay, now we know there's a raptor out here somewhere. Where's the nearest car? Back that way. Okay, we're gonna run across the street. Get inside. If you're wondering, oh hey, there we go. There's our, our last set of two, I think, to make a set. Every so often, I don't know why this happens, but I make a shemag instead of rags. And I have not figured out why that happens, but I'm always like, oh, for crying out loud, every time I do that. I don't know why. It's so silly. It's so silly. Okay, let's put that away. And before we get rid of the iodine, we'll use that to disinfect. And then we'll get rid of that, because we don't really need two things to disinfect with. Yeah, I think that's about where I stand too, Maddie G. I'm glad you said that because I was starting to think something was seriously wrong. 
Not that it isn't, but uh, I don't think that's the problem. Um, let me see. We can get rid of that if we need to now. And we've got our tack back to eat. We've also got this little guy, the potchki, or brisket. Let's get rid of that. And just eat that up real quick. Keep our stats up. While we wander upstairs and see if there's anything worth liberating from this house. One good thing is that this is not tropical. Because in tropical, you have to watch your temp too. You go inside to escape from zeds or whatever, or dinosaurs in this case, and you start to overheat. So you can't stay inside. So it's kind of like, oh my gosh, you're damned if you do and damned if you don't. Okay. Let's go this way. Oh, this is a two layered town. All right, we've been in that one. We haven't been down here. So we're just going to zigzag back and forth across the street. So we can get to the... Uh, there's no hospital in this town, as we mentioned. So that's why I'm trying to make as many bandages as possible. Oh, jeez. Doors in this... Ever since 1.21 are just making me really irritated. I always get stuck indoors on a regular basis anyway, but they are significantly worse. Okay, can we make it across the street before they... I heard a raptor. Give it a good look. I don't see him up close and personal, so we'll just hop across here. Make sure you go toward the side that has the door on it. Yeah, they're coming. They're floating around in this town. They're not attacking, though. That's interesting. I wonder if there's somebody else in town that they're focused on. Instead of me. That would be an interesting... Hey, has anybody seen whether or not if you shoot at these gas tanks, they blow up? Because I have been super curious. I've been wanting to know that. don't have the answer to that question. Alright, now we're going to run across the street to this house. Get back in real quick. Ooh, hey, there we go. Just what we need. Canned pork. Oh, that's a real good one. We'll eat that right up. Oh, that's too bad. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, man. Yeah, I can see where he's coming from, but darn it, I never even got a chance to play it because the, the pop was so high for so long, I just kind of like put it on a back burner. I guess a lot of people did, and I'm sorry for that because uh, it must be so disappointing to work on something for that long and then just have people not show up. But... Uh, it wasn't for one of trying. I tried for two weeks to get on there and it was just so packed that I couldn't... I don't have the time to wait in a queue. So... I, I'm sorry to hear that though. I wish there was somebody to help people. You know, like OGT has a little bit of help, but he does a lot of stuff on his own for the servers and uh, server owners just get really tired. You know, they, they get... they work so hard. They do pretty well, but uh, it's, I would love it if there was a way to to help out, you know. Okay, we decided we're not going to with shotgun. Somebody, I think somebody might have been through here. Oh, there he is. Now, is there a table to, or a car to get up on or something? I don't see anything close by. He's down that way somewhere. Do 
does not appear to be a car to get up on. We have a gap. Can I get over this fence? Oh shit. Something bigger. Something bigger's on the way. Let's double check that the doors are shut. Yes. Okay, check boots. I haven't checked my boots in a while. We're okay on the boots front. Yeah, I've been here. Sarge is a nice guy. Oh, there's a car. I can get out the door and get on that car. That'd be good. A good place to hang out. No food in here. Maybe I can get a gander at where this guy might be. There's the police department. That's a good place to go. We don't really need guns. That's good. I can hear the... Oh, there he is. Here, do you hear the bigger lower? Something bigger over in here. There's the, there's the wharf over there. Um, let's look at the map real quick. We're in Kamishovo. Well, and then let's see what's going to be our next move. It's going to be Electro, I guess. And that's a long stretch of shore. To get across without uh, getting killed. But we'll use our same strategy we did to get from from there to here. That's a longer stretch, but we can make it. And we can get into the military maybe and find uh, some stuff. But I believe that's going to be... No, it's not. I, I'm surprised that's not a... Um, that's not a red zone. There's a well. There's a hospital there. That's what we're aiming for. Okay, and plenty of stuff to check along the way, and plenty of cars to get up on. Um, I don't know if there are boat are boats on here. All right, so it seems as if they're not particularly being drawn to me. So either somebody else is in town they're going after, or I'm just being so sneaky. What was off the shore? Let's look. Here? That's a lighthouse. If that's what you meant. Off here? There's a... I don't know. It's just a little couple of buildings there. Looks like a... It looks like you can walk across there. Some of these islands had... Um, had a... Uh, Bridges, like from here to here, you could walk across. I wish he'd show up so I could kill him. But at the same time, I'm kind of glad he isn't. I'm going to go raid that little cabin there. I think maybe because I'm being kind of super sneaky, he hasn't really picked up on me yet. I haven't fired off to any shots. I haven't had to defend myself. It hasn't really picked up on the fact that I'm here. Okay, and there I can get to the pub. Or back onto that car. to the pub. Oh, hey. Food. Crunching crisps. 
Yeah, it's um. Oh, there's a raptor. At least one. I think there's two. I think I'm being fairly quiet, and that's kind of throwing them off. They're expecting a lot of shooting, and they're drawn to shooting like crazy, which is why I'm not shooting. There's the police station over there. I thought maybe I'd go along this this street and then work my way over to the next street. Try to be as unobtrusive as possible. We got hit by a triceratops in this town, but we made a lot of noise before it got here, so I'm thinking that we did ourselves in that way. There's definitely at least one Triceratops around this area. Yeah, that's a bigger one. We got up on a shed roof. I wonder if I can do that here. <coughs> yeah, this is a really good firing zone. Nanu and I were doing this. Good night, Maddie G. Oh yeah, there he is. Oh, you have a great one, and thanks again for the tip. I so much appreciate it. That's the big one I was hearing. I'm gonna let him wander wander on by if I can. They're awfully aggressive, though. I doubt he's gonna be happy about leaving me up here. see. There aren't a lot of other good places to hang out to shoot them from, so I might just go ahead and... Uh, I, not, I don't like to use up the ammo if I don't have to, so if he attacks me... Look how they are, though. They're so cool. He's just sniffing along, minding his own business, but they are hyper-aggressive. On a um, after days... Uh, Jurassic Isle, they are not at all aggressive. So I was very surprised the first time I played here. And I thought, oh look, it's a Triceratops. They're Vegisauruses. They're not dangerous. And skewer. Next thing I knew, I was deader than a doornail. If I run for it, he's coming. Hmm. Let's see. Got two or three more houses down this way. All right, he's not paying attention to me, so I'm going to go ahead and call it a win. Oh, here comes a raptor. You heard me that time. You heard me that time. Whoosh! Boy. Uh-oh. Oh, now he's alerted the Triceratops. Oh yeah, here he comes. Freight train. And I'm not no longer in a position of strength, so that was the bad move. Oh shit. Hello. Oh, look, jam. <laughs> excellent, uh, excellent reward for killing a triceratops. Oh my gosh. Well, that actually didn't work out too bad. I have had him glitch right through the wall. <laughs> so, as I, I should have stayed up on top of that shed, but I got impatient. Don't throw up, don't throw up, don't throw up. You can do it. Stuff that jam in. There we go. I see bullets. Oh, 357s. Do I want to keep that? I don't have anything that goes with I don't think so. Executive decision. We're not taking on tons of bullets for guns we don't have. Oh, there's his little toes. Oh, I feel bad killing those things. Even though you kind of have to. Once they charge like that. 
Now where did the Velociraptor go? That is a burning question. And why is he not here? Oh, that's a good find. 308s. Oh, if I could find the tundra. There he is. Poor little guy. All he wanted to do was kill me. Uh oh. Comes a raptor. Didn't make it very far. Playing hard to get again. All right, so we want to get across the street to that sh that house across the street. So we're gonna blitz for it. Through the gate, through the door. We made it. See, I keep finding things with um, paper in them, so I do think I'm following somebody. Salty snack. There we go. Oh boy. I'm glad we survived the triceratops though. They do eat up a lot of bullets. You know what I should do is check the load on this. Yeah. Yeah, we're down to 17. So let's go ahead and reload. We'll switch out for one of our other ones so we're ready. But then we'll reload this one while we have a minute. This will eat up a lot of the bullets and give us some more storage. And uh, the bullets do stack higher in here than they do on other servers. So I came from that one. We don't have very good view from this house. This would not be a good house to defend. Well, it wouldn't, it wouldn't. The good part is there are parts of the house where you can get to that don't have windows. The bad thing is you can't see out to, to fire on your attackers very well. And you have a very limited set of places you could stand to shoot back and then that would be uh, a little easy to pick you off it would seem like. That would be my take on it anyway. Alright, so we're going to try and make the next house. Something bigger is out there. We made it. Right, something much bigger. Is that another, um... I don't know what that was. I didn't recognize the growl. Oh, these things are good to get up on too. <coughs> For some reason they can't get you from up here. Oh, there's one that can shoot over there. Oops. <coughs> That's the raptor. <coughs> All right, come on over here, buddy. <laughs> I must have almost almost killed him before. But yeah, for some reason these dumpsters they cannot get up on, and or they don't get up on. I don't know if they can't or they just don't. Whichever, it works out. And you have unlimited stamina on here, so that's a good thing too. You, you'll notice my stamina bar, which is extremely unusual for me to have more than an eighth of an inch of stamina. Oh, oh yes. We need that. Goodbye, you. You're useless. You, you're not. You think, well, you have a compass. Why do you need, or you have a map. Why do you need a compass? Well, because the map doesn't tell you which way you're going. It just shows you on the map, so you have to walk a ways to see whether you're going in the right direction or not. Which, more often than not, I'm not. And I waste a lot of time running around in circles. 
I don't know if anybody else has the same problems I do with directions, but man, I'll tell you. All right, now I found some unknown food, so we're going to go ahead and eat the bacon. See, once you get off that island onto the mainland, food is not really a huge problem. Food or water. Now, I believe there's a... I'm going to look at the map real quick. Because I think there might be a well in this town, but I'm going to double check. Also, I, I, I don't know if this is smart or not, but I, I don't see any downside. I've gotten in the habit of opening the foods of can, cans of food when I get them. When you're in a situation where you might... Uh, you might not have enough time to open a can or be in a safe position to open a can. So you guys can let me know what you think about that, but I tend to open the cans and carry them open. And I haven't seen a downside yet, but I'm sure there probably is one. Okay, we're going to try to make it to that one. I think that's just the last house on this side. Alright, and that's... There's two more houses on that. Oh shit, there's another raptor. <coughs> and that's what happens when you start going loud is you... Um, like when you're in a group and you're fighting together, uh, it's really fun and you go loud and... Oh hey, there we go. Um, the only problem is... They keep coming. They are attracted by the sound. So, um, when you have four or five people shooting, it just is constant, constant that you're um, trying to keep ahead of the, from the, um, that, those are, all right, we're going to swap those out because those look so much like the other, I might miscount. Okay, I've got 317 of those, plus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 417 of those. I've got two... Four of those, so 417 plus 4 is 817 plus 2 full mags on my, or relatively full mags. So I've got about a thousand bullets. And, let's see, has anything started to wear yet? No, so I'm going to go ahead and take a chance that I really don't need the second gun clean kit. Because I am concerned about my boots wearing out. So let's go ahead and get rid of the second hand cleaning kit. They're both the same, so hate to do that. Man, it hurts to give up on a gun clean kit. Because almost every other game, every other server, you're struggling to find those. But I'll leave it for somebody else. And I want to get over to that side of town too. Alright, so that was the last house in this row. No, one more house. And there's a Velociraptor out here somewhere. Hopefully not in this house. Wouldn't that be surprising? You run in the door, and there's a Velociraptor sitting there, like, sipping tea, you know, like, hello. I don't think I will pick those up. Somebody else might need them. Oh, cat food. Cat food. Alright, we're going to get rid of the iodine. Oh no, really? Is Tech 2? Did he just decide not to be a server owner anymore? <coughs> oh man, I did not know that. I feel sorry now. Oh, I got you. Did I get him? I did. Oh, there's a Velociraptor though. Oh. I'm really sorry to hear that, One Bad Soldier. I really loved his servers. Zar is such a great guy, too. And I, Oh, man. That really is a bummer. I wish there was something that could be done. Let's see if I can get up here. Oh, shit. Now's not that time to find out you can't get up there. Oh boy. 
him. Something much bigger. Oh, hey, look. It's the whole up and onion. I'll have to get up there and get a good picture of that. Yeah, his maps were awesome. I'm sorry. Oh, there it is. Way over there. Let's see. Another trike. <coughs> oh, there's another one of those guys. Okay, now did that attract the trike? It did not. I am going to have to go along here sooner rather than later, but I don't know whether it I can go on the water side. Well, damn it. That's too bad. You don't like to hear somebody who's done such a great job to become disheartened about stuff. I know that there's an awful lot of great people in our community, and I would hate to think that some one bad soul kind of ruined it for him. I hope it was a yeah. get in, get in. They're coming. Yeah. Oh, what's that? CR five twenty seven. <coughs> I'm gonna send him a note because um. Uh, I want him to know that there's an awful lot of us that will be sorry about that. I never got a chance to play very often because it was always so full. And then by the time I got around to doing it, I was busy trying other maps that I had tried in the interim. So that's, you know, sort of what happened. I think that must be what happened a lot of time. Is that people just got busy. Oh, here comes a velociraptor. <coughs> oh, man, that was close. Those little sons of guns are super quick. A great little <coughs> bastard. Ah, it just died again. Ah, oh, son of a gun. Alright, bear with me a moment, guys. We're going to get back on. I'm not sure what's happening, but uh, that's actually a whole gain crash. That's not a that's not a little hiccup. That's not like a ping spike. That's different. Luckily, I'm up on the truck. I don't think I've killed it though. I've shot it a few times. We might be getting close to a server restart now. Well, thank you for sharing that one, Bad Soldier. I will, I'm going to send him a DM and just, uh, I hope he, uh, he, he worked really hard on Sarani. Jeez, I was so excited to play it, too. Well. All right, for those of you wondering where we are, that red dot on the map is Kamishovo. Uh, 26 minutes for the restart. Alright, so let's take advantage of the fact that none of the big ones are chasing us for the moment. Get onto this house. Oh, there he is. We got some more apples there. I haven't had to hit my water for a while because I've been able to get the fruit and the... Oh, there's some food. Excellent. What good timing. Finding just enough to stay ahead of it. Boy, that noise, though. They're so loud. <coughs> Must be pretty close. get into a, a view where you can see the... Can you get up on this wall? <coughs> I 
think you can. Yeah, you can. Shoo. I hear him. Is he right below me? Alright, can I get down the wall without falling? See any apples? I don't. I don't see any on the ground. We're almost all the way to the police department. I know there's more apples over here. These uh, fences have gotten me caught up more times than I could say. These little low fences. Okay. Okay, there's something big coming. I think I'm going to get, if I can. Yeah, we got all the way here one time. And then we got the shit kicked out of us here. Uh, we just got hit by wave after wave after wave of velociraptors. So I'm glad to see that the quieter you are, the fewer there are. I thought that might be the case. Shit, I'm gonna fall off this fence if I'm not careful. Maybe that's that triceratops that's down that way, but it sounds like it's over that way. All right, there's the well. So let's just go ahead and drink up one of our waters. run down there and fill up. I th oh, there he is. fell off backward. No, he's down there. There he is. Jeez, they make a lot of noise. Anybody see anything else? Huh, oh, all right. All right, we're gonna get down. Let's run for it. Ah, ah. Oh shit, there's another one. Fill it fast. Put it away. Get up. Somebody's coming. It's a lot bigger. I'd like to be up on top of the police hope. Oh, hey, what's that? Oh, it's just a pioneer, but doesn't that look cool? Nice looking one. Boy, they got such nice skins. Uh, I've been playing a, a nut. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's an emlock. Okay. Um, you know what? I'm not feeling the need for a pistol somehow. <laughs> I don't, I, I'll have to wait till I find a bigger backpack to get a pistol. And that's a nice one. But I don't know what exactly I thought I needed coming in here, but that's always good to check, don't you think? Some gloves. Oh, door's wide open. Duh check our gloves. These are worn pristine wool. 
Or medium or pristine best, okay. We'll stay with the black theme. The color scheme. Oh, there's another one. Okay, so we could potentially shoot the crap out of something with a pistol, but seeing as how I don't have a holster and I can't carry it on my belt or anything, I think I'm going to pass. If I find a holster, that would be a different story. Jeez, they're everywhere. That's good to know. But I've got so much ammo and some such a more effective gun. Maybe not as easy to aim, but... Alright, so now we've got the big guy who's coming around. Oh my gosh, another pioneer. Well, let's go ahead and steal the ammo, because we might be able to use that. We find a better gun. got a better one. All right. There's our water. We're just going to do these last couple of houses. What's up that road, I wonder? I can't remember. Okay, let's look and see. I think that one goes up. Yeah, that one goes up just to a dead end in the hunting lodge kind of area. So we're now going to go back through town to the shore and follow the shore because I, th I don't think we want to be away. That one triceratops is right over here unless that's the one I killed. I'm not sure. Um, and we want to stay close to the shore and get our, our ourselves down here to Electro. This is a pretty good jaunt we've made so far surprised I'm still alive but we don't need uh, I think we can skip looting those houses we've got food now we've got a good quantity of food we've got ammo what we really need is uh, better bandages so I think we're gonna go ahead and make a run for that try to get to Electro go check these. I just have to yearn to check these uh, apple trees. There we go. And I'm going to run and eat it in the shed. Check the shed for anything useful. Oh! Oh! Now see, I had heard that there were punch cards on here. And I don't know what they go to. Does anybody know? I think we found one the last time we were on here, but we never got anywhere to actually use it. Is it? It's probably a bunker in one of the big millies, would you say? Uh, 380. You know, I don't think I need 380. I'm just going to go ahead and get rid of that. And I'm not going to keep the Mosin ammo. I'm going to hope for a Tundra. And I'm going to keep the 308. And, or a SKS maybe. Although I really don't need them because I've got a really good gun. But that does free up some space. But I'm going to check this out. The patterns and instructions or data. I might regret leaving my flashlight. Yeah, let's take that back. Just in case we need it. Alright, now did we eat our apple? We did. And we have room for one more apple, so we can go and look for one. Server restart in 15 minutes. Okay. That's not so bad. Okay, let's see. Any other apples? Ah, there's one. Oh, 
Well, that's not a good place to hide from a velociraptor. Oh. Ah, shit! Ah, shit! God damn it! I had just said those damn fences help fucked me over again. Those little short fences. I gotta get on that fence, that the tall fence, but I got hung up on that short fence. They're so fast, you guys. The velociraptors are so fast. You can't fuck around with them. Excuse my language. Come on, we got gotta get on that fence. And you can't bleed to death. Shit. One objection I have is how long you stay unconscious on these servers, especially when you're being ravaged by dinosaurs. You don't have the time. You gotta get up and go. I gotta find my gun, too. There it is. I gotta get up and go. I gotta get up and go. <coughs> I gotta get up here, and then I gotta, I gotta get my uh, bandage. Quick. Here I am going back down to yellow blood again. Shouldn't have gone for that apple, but... Man, you need them. Alright. Now, did he ravage any of my clothes? Oh, I think we're doing okay on that front. We got both of our guns. I'm not really sure why they're not just beating the shit out of me. Now, and I'm not unhappy about it, mind you. But in the past, if a velociraptor hit you, they didn't stop. They just kept after you. But I guess if they're going to make it one hit knock you uncon, then they probably have to do something. They can't really have it continue to hit you. Or people are just going to get dead all the time and be not wanting to play anymore. <laughs> Alright. So where is the velociraptor that hit me? Alright, so we've got our blood and the food going up. I want to check these apple trees really badly, but that's what got me hit that time. That and getting caught on that short little fence. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and check. Well, that one will do. Not perfect, but it'll do if I can't find anything better. Rotten. Don't eat the rotten ones, guys. I had some experience. You don't want to eat the rotten ones. Because sooner or later, you get sick. I don't remember if I've checked this one or not. Yes, I have. Alright, so. We got hit by the raptor, but we're not doing too bad. One thing, I better check my clothes. Make sure there's nothing that needs repair. Um, yeah, that last hit damaged the chest rig. But, boy, I'll tell you what. I think I made a really good decision um, leaving the plate carrier behind. Because if I had the plate carrier on, I would not be able to jump those fences. And you would be, uh, I'd be dead probably. He's close. I don't think I have time to get to that fence. Well, we're going to try for it. Alright. Where the heck is he? Because we have a long haul to go. I'd like to kill him. Anybody see him? He's down that way somewhere. Oh, there he is, over in that field over there. I don't think I can hit him from here. Nope. Um, let's see. What's going to be the safest route? Uh-oh. Now there's something big over that way, too. All right, logic. We need to get out of town. We need to get over to the shore. Oh, here he comes. Little bastard. 
I wish I knew exactly. Ah, there we go. Look how fast they are. They gallop. Oh, little bastard. Can't hit him from here. Alright, let's get up on here. We got a better shot at him. Oh my gosh, it just goes right under me. Alright, so that was the one that hit me. Hope now I hear another one. Alright. Did anybody else hear that or was it just me? We must be pretty darn close to the server. Oh, shut down. I didn't see the timing on that. What I want to do is run across there. Yeah, I definitely heard another one. Okay, what we're going to do is gonna run across to this fence. Hmm. It is a chimsy sky. I definitely agree with that. Oh, there he is. I knew there was another one. Boy, I hope he can't reach up here. Hold still. So it seems to be three hits. That one didn't scream a lot. Alright, now we can get down and run. I wish I knew how far we are from the server restart because I don't want to be caught out in the open. did it again. Uh, something weird happening. Alright, we'll get back in. Just bear with me a moment. Sorry about that, guys. Seems to be a combination of, of keystrokes that is causing the server to, to uh, crash. Luckily, my only concern is, is that we must be pretty close to server restart. And I don't know what happens if the server restart happens while I'm trying to get back in. I'm not sure about that. Alright, I'm going to get a sip while we're waiting. Well, that was good. Oh, he's gone again. Time until next restart. Six minutes, okay. Good, he's gone. He'll be somewhere close by. They are everywhere busy, and if you make mis uh, any noise at all, there are lots of them. The more noise you make, the more you attract, and the more you kill, you're free of them for a little while. Now here's what I wanted to do. I want to take a picture of onions. <coughs> billboard. It's in front of a pile of dead bodies. <laughs> that seems appropriate somehow. Ah! There we go. Alright, now what I want to do is just uh, run like the wind up the coast and get as close as we can to Electro before the server restart so that we can get into the water if we have to. There's a, a triceratops somewhere along here, I think. Unless that's the one I killed. Because it is possible I've already killed him. 
Here are those little islands that uh, Maddie G was asking about. They're, they're not far off, and I don't know whether or not you can escape from uh, dinos. Well, we're going to find out by going across to them. Because the dinos don't go through water. Oh, they're already over here. All right, well that was a, a no, no that answer is no. <laughs> they can walk right across there. Just followed me right along there. So you can get away from them by stepping into the water. You can't stay in the water for long periods of time because you get too cold, but not too bad, not too fast. So it's a good solution. Oh, hey, there we go. Here comes another one. Welcome in. Welcome. Um, I'll give you a shout out in just a moment. We're about two minutes from the server restart. And I'm trying to get the flock out of there to uh, Electro so I don't wake up dead. Three, three minutes. I don't know if I can make it. Oh, shit. Certainly not before this asshole hits me. They're so fast, but I'm quick too. And he didn't make me bleed that time. Ha! <laughs> Welcome! Welcome everyone! We are killing dinosaurs and we're trying to stay alive. Oh shit. And we're trying to get to Electro before the restart. Or at least to some kind of a building or a car or something that we can get up on. You know little bastard. Oh there you are. Little guys are so damn quick. No, you're dead though. They pop right out of the water. I don't know if you guys have noticed that, but every so often they just materialize at the edge of the shore. I don't think I'm going to be able to make Electro from here. Uh, I think we've got two minutes. So, i get down, down to one minute and then we'll just log out. Oh, uh, hi Fire Dingo! Hello! Uh, this maybe was a bad decision to run for it at that time. and We should have just probably stayed in Cammy Shovo, but I wanted to try and get to somewhere in Electro. There's a building right up there. I don't think I can make it that far in the time allotted, but I'm going to try for it. If I get rolled back, it'll just be back farther up the course, coast. Um, the dinos along here, they nickel and dime you to death. Uh, just cut, the, cut you to ribbons. But they're not velociraptors. So, one thing I have noticed, and I don't know if this is going to be the... Oh, shit, there's a huge one over... Oh, no. <laughs> there's a huge one just down the shore. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Well, we'll give it a couple minutes, and we'll hope that he's not standing right over me when we log back in. <laughs> but let me get to shout-outs now that it's safe. Relatively. And thank you so much for rating, and I hope you guys had a great run. And I don't know what you are, what, what server were you playing on. go one for fire dingo as well and had I hope everybody had a, a very nice Memorial Day as it's coming to an end uh, the and Bitsy the aggro range on the dinosaurs is they're all aggressive um, the little guys pick you off in groups of two and three and they just cut you to ribbons like foxes or wolves um, you start bleeding uh, from the first hit. Hi, Chad. Welcome in. Um, the Velociraptors are hyper quick, and they hit you so hard, they knock you uncon with, like, one blow. Um, but in the past, they would rip you to shreds while you were uncon. But they aren't doing that now. They're actually hitting you and walking away, which is kind of strange. So it's a little bit like a bear. They're small, but man, are they fast, and they're so scary. And they make so much noise. The Triceratops, um, if you can sneak around them, they don't hunt you, but any noise will attract them. 
and especially gunfire. And so if you're shooting something else and the Triceratops shows up, the best place to be is like up on one of those sheds or something. So get up somewhere. Because like you saw the one I killed came right through the wall into the house. Um, they can glitch all the way through and then you're done. You're squashed. They just squash you flatter in a pancake. And uh, the one that caught me in the open just ran right over me. I could hear him coming behind me and there was nowhere for me to go and I just went splat. <laughs> it was actually kind of funny. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Was Des on here too? Uh, or on somewhere with raptors? Uh, man, I'll tell you. So I tried to get on... Um, yeah, they hit like tanks. That's exactly right. They're little like bowling balls um, with teeth. But I had made a choice earlier to switch out my plate carrier uh, uh, to a, this little chest rig that I've got on. It's not a plate carrier. It's um, it's a lighter weight one and it's got pouches so I think it's more like a press vest. But um, it has allowed me to jump on and off of fences and things and sheds. Uh, if I had the plate carrier on which weighs 14 kilos I think this wing weighs 2. Um, I don't think I would have been able to get up on there. Um, also, uh, you eat up a lot of your food and water faster when you're that much heavier. Um, I also picked up this leather jacket, which is the scorpion biker jacket. or th I think this one is not the scorpion. This is just the regular biker jacket. Uh, we figured out that the leather jackets uh, definitely uh, reduce your bleeding uh, possibility. So... If you uh, have a choice between like a regular tactical jacket and one of these, if they have the same amount of pouches or slots, which it did, then the leather jacket, if it's, you know, is always, uh, yeah, yeah. Plate carriers are good, though, against the dinos. I won't, I won't hesitate to say uh, they really help. But you know what's helped me a lot is this crazy looking helmet. I found it in one of the um, sw spawn area little uh, places and put it on. I thought, okay, well, I'm going to put the faceplate on. It's kind of silly, but I'll try it out. I, th I think that's saved me several times. Um, it's not me uncommon, but it hasn't killed me. So maybe they would still kill you if you started to bleed or if you didn't have really good head protection. I don't know. But the, um, the chest rig is now worn, so I've taken two or three really good hits, and I have not had too much bleeding. The little guys make you bleed. They nip you. Uh, just terrible. Um, so, so far, I'm going to go see if we can get it back in yet. So far, it's the little guys that they hit you in squads and they just bite the shit out of you. It's so annoying. It, it, they move so fast that I have trouble targeting them because I'm not good at hip firing. But it is good for me to practice hip firing. Uh, let's hope that that big guy down the, down the beach is not there anymore. Oh, shoot. Holy crap. Okay, next restart, 3 hours and 56 minutes. There was a huge dinosaur down there on the beach. Uh, I don't know what kind. But this is the edge of Electro. I almost made it to Electro, guys. Look how close I came. And it was down here on these rocks. Oh boy. I don't know where it went. They don't tend to be too far away from where they were when you spawn back in. So he might be up in the area around that. I'm going to just go into crouch sneak mode and see if I can make less noise on this beach. Hi, what a rookie! Yeah, this assault helm doesn't obstruct my vision at all. I really like it. If it had, um, if it had given me like the little raccoon eyes, you know where you have like a limited field of vision, I wouldn't wear it. I was kind of hoping they had boats on this server because that would be super fun to skim along, you know, and just touch in. Kill a few dinos, get back on your boat, hit the road. Oh, hey! You see that green car over there? I think that's a drivable car. Ooh, we gotta check that out. Is there a car spawn along here? Now let's look at the map real quick. And we'll see where we are. <coughs> Excuse me. We're on the very edge of Electro here. And here's where I'd like to go. To the hospital. So that means I have to go across the railroad tracks. 
up this road and over that way. It's kind of a long way through some difficult terrain. You know what I have noticed, and I don't know if this is going to be the case everywhere we go on here, because I haven't been too many places, is there are no Zeds. Oh, hey, Vanderkiller. Vanderkiller, welcome to see you. Good to see you. Let me see. Guys, Evander killed streams, and I wanted to do this the last time. Um, do give I'm going to give him a shout out, him or her, excuse me, I don't want to assume. Um, but if you guys could have a moment to drop a follow at about 25 right now and needs to get to 50 for affiliate. So uh, that would be very much appreciated if you could help out. And uh, let me see. If you just came in, we saw a giant dinosaur on these rocks when we when we were walking up. And then we had the restart and it disappeared. I don't know where it is. Oh, you're very welcome. Um, my pleasure. Uh, somebody helped me out when I was starting and I like to, to spread that wealth. Yeah, I think that is a drivable car. I think that's the same car I stole the last time I was here. So maybe it wasn't anybody's car. Maybe it was uh, like that's a car spawn. Oh, that would be nice. Well, let's see. Oh, isn't this nice? Oh my gosh. Yeah, bite me. Ha, I'm safe. Okay, we got gas. We don't need anything. Let's take off. Let's run that little... Uh, uh, over. All right, where are we going? I have a car. Go up to the road. Go left on the road. And go right around the curve. And into the center town to the police station. Right before the police station. And then left. Okay. Let's try and figure it out as we go. Oh my gosh. Does that sound nice or what? You guys, we're so lucky. Alright. I have a kind of a limited field of view in this thing. It's like a tank. I probably could drive in there, as a matter of fact, but I don't know if I can get over that. There seems to be a little hump there. Let me look at the map again. What happens if I drive in there? Can I? I might be able to. I don't know. It doesn't give me enough detail, but no. It looks like you can get on the, even the wharf. Let's give it a try. I think we can make it. Yep, we made it. Wow, this thing is great. I love it. On the road now, guys. I don't know if I can fit through there. We're gonna find out. Oh, this is so cool. I hope this isn't anybody's car that needed it, because we're stealing it. Well, it drives like a tank. Probably is a tank now that I think about it. <laughs>
try not to ram into any of these fences because they uh, can get you hung up. I don't know if I can get over the railroad tracks or not. I don't think so. Maybe I can. Well, let's see. What do I do now? We'll go this way. I think we need to get away from here. Because I don't think we can get over the railroad tracks. I don't think so. Probably getting stalled out by a tree or something. If I see any fences, let me know. Because we can't go through fences in this thing. I don't think. Maybe we can if we go fast enough. Aha! A road! There we go. Wow, this thing is hard to control. But, huge. Sweet. There's a firehouse over there. I think we're just down from the hospital. Which is where I want to go, so let's, let's make a turn. Alright, now we're... Where are we in town? Okay, this is the main street. Where is the hospital? Oh. Yeah. Wow, you're pretty invulnerable in this thing. Alright. Let me see the map real quick. Oops. Zoomed in too far. A little bit too close. A little bit too close. Alright, so we went over here somewhere. We went across the railroad track somehow. And we are just up from... What's around? It's a firehouse. It's uh, down that way. I saw that. Oh, there I am. Duh. I can see myself on the map. Alright. So I need to go right and then left and then left again to the hospital. There's a well here, but I don't really need one. Alright. I've been practicing driving. Right, and then left. Where's the left? Is that here? Boy, oh, there's an awful lot of uh, traffic. Oh, hey, there's a military right here. Let's, let's stop and look at that. And then I think we gotta get up around this corner to the left. So we'll go around the corner to the left first. There. Stop here. Good thing I've been practicing driving, isn't it? Hi, turtles! <coughs> Alright, now hopefully they don't hop in the car and take off while I'm gone. <laughs> that would suck. You come back, your car's gone. All right, now I want to go across the street to that two-story milly thing. Oh, I like the kitty cats. Wow, where'd you get all those great mo emotes? Those are terrific. <coughs> Yotec hollow sight. Gloves. Ooh, hey. Oh, and there's some more of those bullets. I think I've got a stack of those already. I thought I did. Where did they go? Did they go in there? Yep. There we go. <laughs> those are great. I, I think I recognize most of them too. Oh, those are so... I like the... Is that a bear or a kitty that's shaking its head at the first one? Because it could really be either one. They're really cute. Thank you very much. And welcome in. Oh, there's some more bullets over here. I think those are 9 by 3 nines. Uh... Does that go on here? It does. What does that add to the picture? Does that make it easier to... Huh. Let's find out. Let's see, where did I put my battery, guys? Oh, there it is. It is in the... There. 
Now, let's see. How does that help? Oh, that does help, actually. Huh. Well, we'll give it a try. I hear a raptor. Okay, car is right by the bus, guys. But there was something I wanted to see up here. The police station. That's what we wanted to go to. We're going to go downstairs here, too. See if there's anything. I see some bullets. Oh, there's some more 9x39. I don't have room for them. And... Honestly, I don't think they're all that great. Stopping power. I thought they would be. But they're not. Surprisingly. Okay. So... What will we get at the police station that would be worthwhile? Is it worth a, shot, a stop? Uh, we might find some 556. Five, We've got plenty of 556, five, but we might find some. Other than that, I don't think we need anything from the police station. Alright, let's go check it out. They never have any food in here. Uh, they might have tack back, I suppose. I've never seen food in the police station. They have M locks, but uh, to be honest, an M lock is not going to do a whole sh buttload of good against a dinosaur. Um, I think you'd probably need three or four bullets for every one of the um, small dinos. Nine by nineteens just are not going to cut it. There's a pioneer, but it doesn't have a mag. Let's see what we can find. I don't believe we're in PvP land. Uh, that's 45s. No, that's 380s. We could get some 45s. That would be good. But I don't remember ever getting too many of those from the police station. I usually end up with shotgun shells and... F yeah, scorpions and 380s. So... Nothing down here. Let's check down here. Not the scorpions. I do love to have those pistol suppressors and it's hard for me to leave them behind. <laughs> but... Alright. There's another pioneer. No mag. Do -do. You know what? I'm just thinking... It does seem like fighting dinosaurs in a town is easier than fighting them in the countryside. Look at all the things you can get up on. Oh, there's another pioneer up on there. I don't know, maybe I'm wrong, but it seems to me that an urban dinosaur uh, situation is to your advantage. Oh, hey, what's that? Oh, it's a bison. Oh, it hasn't got any ammo, but it does have a battery. Hot dog. We'll steal that. And again, 9 by 19s are not going to... I mean, you might eventually whittle your way through a dino with a <laughs> bison, but you use up a lot of ammo. Do 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 crazy Weslows. I like them. Those are really cool emotes. Alright, so what else do we want? Oh yeah, we want to go up to the hospital. That's up that hill. I've been here before. I just don't remember the um the Millie corner <coughs> here. So maybe that's new for this server. Alright, anything down that way we want? Obviously, we would like... Oh, holy shit. There's a huge one. What is it? I don't know. But I'm not liking the idea of fighting that. <coughs> not from here. We need something taller. Looks like it's chewing on somebody. Holy crap. What is that thing? Is it a Dimetrodon? I think it's a Dimetrodon. Look at the size of that fucker. I mean, excuse me. Where can I shoot that from that would be safe? Up high, on top of that bus. 
Yeah. Let's just uh, get in our car and go that way. Quietly. Oh, I'm gonna check this out. Oh, this is a. I know where I am. I know where I am. I've been here before. Oh, I know where I could fight him from. Up on top of one of these sound things. Oh, look. Really cool shoes. Look at those suckers. All right. All right, now we want, I know where I am. I've been here before in this electro area, right downtown with all the Nilly stuff. Usually there's a bazillion Zeds in here, but I don't see any. So we're gonna take a chance. See if we can come up with anything useful. Four nine by three nines. Is that, yeah, nine by 19s, nothing. Close this. Uh oh. This isn't the one I wanted to be on top of. I want to get up on that one over there. Can I make it? I think I can make it. Yeah. I'm gonna get up here. I think that I would be up out of biting level because I'm as high as the top of that barn. Let's try it, guys. We only live once. What do you say? Should we try it? Should we try to kill it? Oh, no. Here I said no Zeds. And look, one just ran up. Must be like the only one left in town. All the dinosaurs ate the rest. And dinosaurs are like, man, this Pickens is pretty slim around here. Oh, no, no, he went away. Shoot. Well, if I shoot the Zed, he'll come back, probably. All right, we're going to go for it. Where is the Zed? Anybody see him? Jeez, he's hard to hit. Little sucker has a... Oh, he's underneath the lip. I don't see any other ones. Where'd this guy come from? Alright, we're just going to go ahead and shoot. There. Now we're going to shoot louder. Only hit him in the back and he didn't fall down. There. been a bad idea. Oh my god, I got him, you guys. I got him. Holy shit. Oh my gosh. Oh, 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 oh my god. <laughs> oh, that was exciting. I was actually inside. Oh my god, look at the size of his feet. Oh, now what do I do? These suckers are... Oh, look, they're trying to kill the Zet. The raptors. Go for it, dude. Oh, there we go again. <laughs> so I'll be back in just a sec, guys. I don't know what what is causing that, but... Uh, every so often, this particular uh, server is shutting itself off. Or kicking me off. One of the it's just shutting, closing down. So, just give me a sec. I'll be back in. <laughs> yeah. Now I got all the electro on me. That's okay. That's okay. We'll go back to silence and pick them all off. And that makes it a little easier to wander around town. I don't believe I'm in a militarized zone because I looked at the map first, and I was surprised to discover that this was not a PvP zone, so hopefully that means people will respect that and not shoot me off the top of this thing. But, 
I got shot on a PVE server last night, so probably doesn't hurt help. <laughs> I got the living shit shot out of me, as a matter of fact. Oh, good. Now they're- Oh, no! My dino's all gone! I didn't get to take a picture of him. Ah! Oh, mother! Oh, well. The Zeds are gone, too, so... They'll be somewhere close by. There was a bunch of Millie Zeds, so I'm sure they must be around here somewhere. Mostly what I was looking for in these things was food. I don't see any. I think that's it. Just the one tent. And a couple of uh, concession stands. I don't think there's anything else worth it here. We'll get back in our car and make like a popsicle in. Get the block out of here. That didn't make any sense. Alright, so now I need to go down here. Let's look at the map again. This is very handy. There's another raptor. Alright, so I just need to go up this road where I'm on and then take a left. I'll be at the hospital. That's good. I wonder what would happen if I encountered one of those great big green ones while in this thing. Would I run him over or would I get squashed? I don't know. sure if I'm supposed to go left here or not. Yeah, I am. There's a grocery store, so I could look for some food there. Boy, I can't see very well around these corners. Oh, that's what it is. There's a, a doohickey. All right. We're going to go this way. This car is not easy to drive, let me tell you. It's it's, she's a big. I have to fit between that curb and that sign. There we go. I think we made it. Boy, they've got everything blockaded. Oh my gosh, there's a big guy. Holy crap. Did you guys see that guy? He was even bigger and scarier than the... Well, maybe not bigger and scarier, but definitely as big. All right, we're gonna... We, all we have to do is get to that ladder. Get on, get on, get on. What are you doing? Shit. It's not let me on the ladder. Well, what the... That ladder's always been climbable in the past. Oh, thank God. Whoa! Alright, now, where's that guy? Where's that big guy? YOLO. There he is, I hear him. Well, worked the last time. Da, 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 da. Oh, the lazy boogers. All right, now I hear him rumbling. Is that Velociraptor on the roof of the fire station? It is. It's in the fire station. Oh, that's weird. How did he get up there? 
And how do I shoot him? Sitting behind that thing. I see his tail every so often, but I can't get him. Okay, well, I'm not getting as much attention as I was hoping for. I can hear him, but I don't think he can get down. And that big one went that way somewhere. I can hear him. Well, let's... Maybe that'll get him. Okay, we got 29 bullets left. Yeah, hi. You don't fool me for a minute, Mr. Zed. You can't climb a ladder. Just don't fall off the roof. Boy, they're really good at getting right under the lip of a building, aren't they? That big dinosaur is being very shy. Not wanting to come back. Right. Let's go on up. Oops. Let's go on out to the top. See if we can spot him from up here. Sometimes it pays to get everybody to come to you because you can shoot them all. Sometimes it does not. Because all I attracted was a couple of Zeds. One hopes they can't... Whoa, gosh. Don't eat me off the roof, please. Don't eat me off the roof. Nope. Alright, well... Let's go looking for uh, medical supplies then. That's why we came. We might as well actually do our goal. <laughs> Where did that big dinosaur go? Did you see guys? He went off down that way. And it looked like he had spikes on the back of his head or something. Not sure what you would call that. Like a spikosaurus. Boy, I have to say, either somebody's raiding the Millie or they just aren't that well situated. Okay, now we're just going to take the one codeine pill and enjoy ourselves. Somebody's coming up the stairs. Uh, it might be outside. Outside this door. Oh, raptor. They'll come right in, no doubt. Alright, there's a blood bag. There's my car. Look at that, isn't that slick? I'm gonna take a picture. Yeah, the dumpster's right in front. That makes it very picturesque. Yeah, they do attack each other. I've never seen that before. I Honestly, these are the first Zeds I've seen on the whole map, so. I was kind of surprised for a little. That ought to call him. Forgot. Oh, you know what? I left my, uh. I left my silencer up on the roof. I gotta go get it. Oh, shit. There he is. I am able to hit him. I'm seeing blood. Oh, there we go. Oh my gosh, look at his butt. <laughs> Dino butt. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh, it's a Vigentiosaurus. I think I left my, um, my silencer on the short roof. 
Do I have to go up there? Oh, that is so funny. Look at him. Oh, I want to take a picture. But I can't get a good angle from here. All the other dinos are messing with my tourism. <laughs> oh, here comes another uh, raptor. All right, now how many bullets do I have left? Two. Yeah, good idea. We'll swap. Well, it's still pristine. I can't believe it. And the gun? Still pristine. Jeez, it took a beating and it just keeps on uh, ticking right along. Oh, that was so cool. I did. I got him. Oh, there's his tail. Holy mackerel. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Let's get a picture of that, too. That is funny. Uh, what was it called again? A gigantic something or other? Not a thing in this milli, or er, in this med. So where the heck are all the bandages? I guess you don't get any. Alright, I gotta get back up on the roof. Let's check the car. There we go. No? Oh yeah, there's one. <coughs> Shit. Now, let's get rid of something, because these bandages are more important. <coughs> what can we get rid of? Excuse me, oh, I'm so sorry. What can we get rid of? Ah! We shall eat our way to more space. This sky is really freaking me out. It's like a chimsy sky on a regular map. Alright, so I need to go get back up to that roof and see if I can find my silencer because I took it off to make noise to attract that dinosaur. And it worked to a T. So I think that it should be up here somewhere. There it is. Thank gosh. And it's still pristine too. That's so amazing. Yeah. Now look. Oh my gosh. Look. Maybe we can get a good shot of him from up here. Oh my golly. That's a cool looking photo. Look at his teeth, guys. Oh, I wish I had a friend that could go stick his head in that mouth and I could take a picture. Uh, <laughs> uh, who do you think I could talk into doing that? Rookie, are you on? <laughs> Oh my gosh, look at him. Oh, he's so cool. I like to see his big feet. So I gotta get down there without getting killed. And I have to decide where I wanna go next because I don't wanna I don't wanna just hop in the car and go. I wanna think it over. Where's a smart place to go? We went through Electro Trovsk military and that was just that one corner uh, in the square I think so that wasn't very helpful but what else what else is in the electro guys the, the car doesn't need gas it's full of gas so where's a good place to go next um, we could go to pick Kozlov I don't know what that is Kozlova that's in a PvP zone I think we should go up here to Poka to Poika military. Um yeah, you you do get meat, but as soon as you cut them up, then they spawn more. Oh, let's go up to the dam. Yeah, that's cool cuz there's a hospital there. They might be more bandages. So let's go that way. Uh we'll go back down here to the second left and go on up the hill. All right, second left on up the hill. Gotcha. As soon as I get a picture of this guy. <laughs> Thanks, to Ricky. That's the only one I could think of who might actually help me take a picture of that stage of picture with a dinosaur.
Oh my gosh, look at him. That's so cool. Oh my god. That is so cool. Look at his hands. Of the Gentiosaurus. Man, that is so cool. I wonder if I can walk right into his mouth. Ugh. Oh, now I got raptors on the way. Let's get on the road. Alright, now I gotta get uh, back around to the front of the hospital. Look what I found, rookie! Just sitting there by the... Oops. Just sitting there by the... Wharf. Let's see if I can get back around here without... Killing the car. Alright, I'm gonna get back to the road. very hard to control this car. He's a huge. Down the hill. Try not to hit anything. Try not to kill it. Whoa. I'm gonna go here. Second left I had to go. Very tough fit, very tight, very tight. Very tight fit. Okay, I think that second left up there by the by the other side of the square. Let me just take a quick peek. Nope, oh, hello. Nope, oh, go go away. Yeah, second one. Alright. Alright, is there anything in the road? Nope. Alright. Killed a great big dinosaur. Uh, where are we gonna go? We're gonna go to Disneyland. Whoa, that was close. All right, now we should be able to just head on out of town. Except they probably barricaded it. Yep. Man, there's barricades everywhere. Hopefully, we can fit over here. Well, these roads do I want to take? I want to stay on the one I'm on. Yep. Alright. I don't want to run over anything, but I get the feeling that I could run over a fairly substantial something in this car. It would be alright. Coming in, turtles. Hang on, I gotta, I gotta turn this down. Thank you for coming in, and, and I hope your day at work is going all right. And thank you uh, for lurking. I appreciate that very much. Ooh, let's run him over. Can we run him over? Oh, did I get him? Ha oh. <laughs> ha I feel vindicated. Okay, now we're trying to get up to the dam. I hope I'll recognize it when I see it. I've been here a few times. But I'm not gonna take the car down in there. I don't I don't think it's too far now. I better take a look at the map. Yeah, it's not too far now. That's not the road I want to take, though, to the left. Have a good one! I hope there's nobody up here that's going to kill me. But, I 
if they do. Look at a lot of good stuff. Well, actually, I don't know if there's anything in this car or not. You know, I never looked. Oh, this is tough to get up these hills. This sucker is not made for speed on a hill. Uh, and I didn't get up enough speed when it, before I hit the hill. All right, my next left will be the... I see it. I think I'll leave the car out here in the road. a really super steep run up and as I recall this is a pretty steep run up from down there yeah no I don't want to be doing that but let's be ready you know what I didn't do is I have not looked in the back of this car at all to see if there's anything in here do you get storage space I, I assume you do Oh yeah, oh my god, you guys. How much storage space do you get? Is it a thousand? Oh my god. It looks like a thousand. Oh my gosh. Now, other thing. Can I get up on top of this sucker? Because uh, that would come in really handy. In a pinch. I can. Alright, good to know. Good to know. This is Cometa. There's a medical facility right there, and there are a bunch of these hunting cheds, which is really my favorite to loot, some of them. I like uh, barracks, too. But, uh, okay, let's get down there and see what we got. I wonder if we've outrun the dinosaurs for a minute. I don't hear any. Let's hope for the best. It's good to know we can get up on our car. Also check for bear traps because somebody might be a clever boy. Boy, have we got a lot of... Uh, I didn't think of that. You know what? I can put stuff in the back of the car. I don't have to carry it all with me. Oh, there we go. I didn't stay gone long. There's another arrow. I haven't seen a crossbow, bolt, uh, crossbow yet, but I assume they must be here. guy's gone, but I hear a, a velociraptor and something bigger. There's a zed. There's a raptor. It's funny how you can get to the where you can recognize the sound they make. Alright, we're safe in here for now. Oh, very cool. Let's see what we got here. This is a uh, pristine, pristine. All right. Let's get rid of the four rags. Let's put these guys in. Now we've got two sets of those. I wish I had room for an ivy bag. Cause boy, you know, I usually need it. Um, I could put one in the car. I could put some of my mags in the car too. Oh, hey, there's a there's a mask too. I have some ideas. There's chlorine. I mean a uh, car uh, charcoal. All right, so we do have there's a blood bag. We could make a blood bag and just keep it in the car or keep, or put something else in the car and keep that with us. Um, I'd like to probably put... Oh look! They are fighting him! I never expected that for some reason. That they would be uh, fighting each other. And they've 
glitched through the wall before. <coughs> Little bastards. Probably should have <coughs> thought twice before I shot at him. Can I hit his tail? much damage. There we got him. Right, come back here. You. We got him that time. He is really hard to... Oh, shit. Thanks for glitching right into the building. Jeez. Freakazoid. Yeah, that was lucky. I was really lucky. Because that could have ended very badly. <laughs> I, shouldn't, I shouldn't be tempting fate that way. Alright, now let's see. Okay, now we've got regular... I Oh, I would like to come back here and grab up a bunch of medical supplies to put in the car. Well, you know what I could do? is I'll just take this lab coat and stuff it full of medical supplies and run for the car with all I've got. That's what we'll do. Then we can make it, I'm sure. Won't be anything scary out there at all. I'm sure of it. <coughs> you guys buying this? Ugh. I wonder if I get up on top of the vehicle. Huh. Oh! Ha! <laughs> ha! Look, I can wear it. Oh, that's cool. Does it need a filter? Face mask used with side mount for filters. Yes, it does. All right, so I didn't see any filters. We're taking back our bandages. By gosh. Since we're going to run for the car with this. And I can make a blood bag or an IV bag, but I can't make both because I didn't have two. Did I miss either? Miss anything? I don't think so. Okay, now. To get to the car, I need to run up that hill and jump on the top of the car. That's a long ass run. Pass these little slashy guys. So the first things we need to do down and kill them. Alright, now where are they? There they are. Okay, that's done. Alright, let's run for the car. We missed one. Go for it. Run, 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 run. Run, 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 run. Get up on top of the car. There we go. That was a good strategy. Alright, and we can put stuff inside. Nope, we cannot shoot. On some cars you can get up on top and you can actually put stuff inside from up top. Like, no, why, why can't I put that down? Uh oh. S slight hiccup. Why can't I put that down? Oh, there I did. Where did it go though? I might have just lost all that stuff. Oh well. It was worth a shot. So they're. they're good sore spot is right behind their head or in the butt 
I've had good luck shooting them in the butt. That looked a little off center, but it still worked. All right, now let's get off of here. Nope. I hear more. I want to get this mask off. And I don't know what happened to the the white thing. It's probably underneath the car, if I had to guess. Oh yeah, there it is. All right. Can we put it in the trunk of the car without this, with the stuff in it? I doubt it. Oh, you can. Oh, nope, you can't. I was wrong. Uh, that figures. Okay. There we go. Get everything out of here. I guess we can keep the lab coat too in case we need to cut it up for bandages. And let's see what else can we put in there. We can put our extra 45 mags that we haven't found a 45 for. We can put our wrench. Uh, we can put our light that we can't use. Extra canteen. Now we have lots more room. We can put our fish hook in there. Put the bullets that we can't use yet in there. Oops. All right, got a lot more room. Put the flashlight away. Uh, the rest of the stuff we're going to keep on our person because I might need it uh, in the pretty quick PDQ. Oh, and the mask. Let's get that off before I suffocate. There we go. Now, do I want to take a chance to s to go through the rest of those? Didn't get much good stuff out of those hunting cabins. So I don't think it's really worth it. I think what I should do instead is uh, go on up to this military. Tapotka military. There, it's not a huge one. Tapotka. And then from there, where do we go? From there, I might go on to Starry. Yeah, that would make sense. Well, now we can go to VMC. Staroy Military. <coughs> okay, so we'll go up here and go through this one. See what we can find. Now that we have a car to fill up. Ha ha ha. All right. We can get going up this hill. Oh, I forgot I can put markers on the map. That'll be very helpful. Here's the dam. It's pretty cool. Afraid to look at it and drive, also. Well, you have a pretty narrow field of vision in here, that's for sure. But it's a pretty damn good car. Almost ran over that guy. Might, might still run over that guy. As a matter of fact. Ah, uh, you bastard. He's running away from me. I wonder if I ran over that. Oh, I did. 
Ha! I ran over the, um... Ooh, what's that? I ran over the dinosaur. What the heck is that thing? Bloodstock. Oh, it's like the one I have on my own. But mine is still pristine, I think. Yep. So I don't really need that. And in this seat, I think I see a... Yep. You'd think I'd find a USG-45 with all this USG-45 stuff I found. Oh, now I can, I can put it all in the car. I can take whatever I want. Ha! We'll take everything. If it's not nailed down, we're taking it. My kind of looting. Okay. Watch somebody come along and poof! All over. Steal my car, steal all my good shit. Game over. <coughs> That'd be okay. We have a good time. Oh, there we go. Excellent. We definitely want that. Get back in the car. <coughs> we definitely want that helmet. those things in there. Excuse me, sorry guys. <coughs> I'm thirsty. <coughs> oh, excuse me, my gosh. <laughs> Okay, I think that was it. No, don't push. Get in. There we go. Alright, now here we go. That was fun. Alright, so we're going to go to the right here. Boy, I'll tell you what. Having found a car is a game changer. is fun. Hi Chris! Oh, can't get up this hill very well though. I'm gonna get a little momentum going here. Give it a little boost. Get up that hill. driving a lot better than I was before. Worky's been helping me learn how to drive better. Of course, every time I say that, then I crash or something. So I should be quiet about that and just say, oh, I suck. My driving is terrible. Um, I, I never will get any better. A little bit too quick there. <laughs> that was sharper than I was expecting. Okay, though. Boy, this is a steep uphill, though. Life changes when you have a like a vehicle that can handle that you can you can actually drive through the zeds with. Look at that sky! Isn't that weird? It's really freaking me out. That's a good landmark. Oh. Velociraptor. Hmm. 
<laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> that was funny. Oh my gosh. Sorry, dude. I flattened you. Uh, yeah, I do need to hydrate. I don't have anything to drink here. Um, let me see. I drank up all my stuff, all my juice, all my chai latte. Okay, nothing there. Oh, God, I thought that was a fishing lure or something. It's like flower sticking through the car door. I was really hoping to find some uh, <coughs> bandages, and I did, so that was good. Accomplished the mission. Uh, I'm not going to take Mo's and ammo. I'll leave it for somebody else. Alright, now let's go. We don't need any more gas right now. Gosh, this is so much fun. Uh, let's look at the map now. Where are we? We're almost to Steroy. And in Steroy we've got a hospital, so we can look for some more stuff there. And a water tap. And a police station. I think that's a police station. Um, and a grocery store. Do we... I, don't, I can't look at um, whether I need groceries. We're going to town. And then we'll uh, we'll make a left or right at some point, either the lower street or the upper. Oops, I don't want to shift up quite yet. Let's go a little faster. Oh wow, that little booger tried to bite me through the car. This is Starry. So, there are two rights there for Mikta, and, and then at the other end of town, there's the, there's the Medi. Oh, there's a, a, a poster for Rev. There. We eliminated that problem. I just squished him. Ha ha ha! That never gets old. Is he sticking out from underneath the car? I don't know. I think I hit him. Oh, yep, I hit him. Oh, now I gotta go quick. This Rev's poster. Very cool. Maybe we'll be able to find a <coughs> filter in here. Because it said you could go to the main um, gas areas with just a mask. You don't need the full NBC. So that's cool. Oh, now I can tell what blood type I am. I like doing that because I like to know. Especially if you're on a team, it's so handy. <coughs> okay, Ricky. I hope your the rest of your day goes well. Let's see. I am uh, a high immunity level. No food poisoning, no cholera, no influenza. No salmonella, no wound infection. And no chemical poisoning. Hot dog. I am well. That's cool. We'll just take everything that we find and we'll put it in the car. I don't know if you can put these kits in the car with stuff in them. You could put them in your backpack with stuff in them so it would make sense that you could, but we won't take any... I think we'll put that in there too. There we go.
Now we can fit that in there. Got a lot of blood bags. I don't really need that many blood bags. What I need is another um, IV start kit. Because then I could have both a... Uh, then I could have both a... Um, an IV and a... Uh, blood bag at, and have them both in the car just in case. I'll probably keep the blood bag on me because that's where you're going to need it the most. Is, but I just don't need to keep picking those up. Just one. One will do one at a time. And no filters. Darn it. No mask and no filters. Now let's find out. Can we put this in there? With stuff inside of it. Yes, oh, that's a relief. Okay. What was the other thing that we wanted to look at in town? Oh, it was a, a the police sto uh, shop. And we want to probably go to the hunting shop. Can I get that far? I don't think so. Maybe he's mad I ran over his pal. There's a pub. And a well here, too. I think I'm pretty much really close to the well. Let's look. Let's look. I have not... I did go past it. Alright, so it is across the street from the pub. So it'll be in that little area by the revs. Um, it'll be somewhere in that little area there. Probably a, very close to where the Velociraptor is. So I'm going to go check that hunting shop. Let's see if we can make it. Yep. Well, that was a weird noise. Oh, look, it looks like University of Michigan. Haha. <laughs> Is it? it seems like it's pretty darn close. There's a church up on the hill too. I wish this one had the kind of front porch that had the... Ah, yeah, he's right at the front door. Okay, now we can go back to the car. something big. Now where is the police office? It should be right behind the medical. And so I just can't see it because I'm inside here. I mean on here. There it is. Alright, let's get over this fence. Thank God for no st or unlimited stamina. Um, again, not really sure what I hope to find in here. So it might be a little bit of a wasted trip, but... I guess I could take one of these uh, to put in the car. I don't need a stab vest. Alright, we've been here. We'll get in a couple of these. And uh, we'll take a couple of mags.
That way we've got a backup plan. All right. I guess I'm just in the habit of uh, searching more, more so than I actually need anything. Uh, so probably we'll go on to the military. It is fun though. It's fun to loot. Alright. That's that. Oh! Speaking of which. An ATOG. wonder if that'll go on my other gun. Oh, it's already got one. Okay, so I've got two different um, scopes already. And that won't go on here anyway. Oh yeah, it will. What's that one like? Oh, that's pretty cool. Huh. Oh, hi, see me play? Welcome in. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, we're, um, we are playing the Jurassic, uh, Cherno. Muddy Waters, and, uh, it's a lot of fun so far. I found this scope. I think I'm going to replace... I've got two different scopes on two different of these versions of these guns. That one's kind of nice. Uh, let's see. Let's try the other one. Yeah, this one I don't I don't like. <coughs> Excuse me, it doesn't seem to really help me much. So we'll put that one on there, and it doesn't take a battery, which is even better. I kind of like that. I'm going to give it a try. I probably will take this one with me, just on the off chance that I don't like the one with the arrow. But Oh, there, that's why there was a guy up here. Why I was hearing sound. I don't need 9 by 19s In fact, did I keep any of those? I don't think I did. Yeah. No, we'll just get rid of those. Can we fix this so I can take both of these things? I know how. We'll just have a little nibble here on the roof. We need to eat anyway. All right, so. We need to get back to the other side of the medical. And then we're going to take this road, I think. Let's take a look at the map. It's so handy to have the map where you can actually see where you are. Okay, so I'm going to go there, yeah. And then I need to go up the road and hang a right. And we're going to go into Steri Military. I don't know if that's got a lot of stuff or just it doesn't look too big, but you never know. Try that out. See what we see. <clears throat> first things first, we gotta get back to the car without getting killed by a raptor. Boy, is that one brave chicken. Alright, down we go. Go 
Go right out the front door. You gotta really run like the wind because those little suckers are fast. And there's our car. Oh man, we just made it. Holy crap. That was so close. Ah, hold still. Oh, he just flew up on the roof. There's the other one. So we killed a couple of Velociraptors. Sorry if that noise see, see me play if that noise was more than you were anticipating for your headset. <laughs> those those raptors are so loud. Uh oh. Oh, there's a big one. Alright, so I can get in my car and drive. And turn right up here without... I don't know whether we get rushed by that or not, though. And I don't know what would happen if he rushed us while we're in the car. I think we're going to have to kill him. No, I can't take stuff off the car. Off. Like I couldn't put anything in... <coughs> that was weird. Oh, I don't think I'm going to have a choice anyway. Can't take my silencer off. The way he's coming, he's going to be right in front of me. <coughs> Unless he... Yep, there he is. I don't think I want to try hitting him with a car. So cool. All right. This is a good platform from which to kill dinosaurs, guys. This is much higher than a regular car. All right, so here's the question. Can we reload mags from up here? Because it wasn't letting me put things away. I don't think I can. Oh, there we go. Yes, I can. Alright, so we'll load up these mags. We might be running shy on the C uh, 357, or excuse me, 556. I've got five or six more boxes of it though, so I think we'll be okay for a bit. And that's one of the reasons why we're going to the military, is to try and get better guns. These are good guns, don't get me wrong. But... <coughs> I'd like to get a AK-101 or a maybe a M4. Boy, it does take a long time to fill up one of these. Do -do 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 -do. Do both of those billboards say congregation? I think they do. So we're gonna have to run back and find out. Now let's refill this one. Uh, yep, we got some more. So far, so good. This has been really fun. Yeah, so even without the car, um, the car has really helped, but even without the car, it is completely possible to do this map alone. So... Just FYI, if you're thinking of it, trying it, but you're nervous to try it alone, I'm not a very good player. And I'm doing okay. I do okay at, at uh, PvE, but I'm trying to get better at being a good shot, so that's why I decided to come on here. So 
I thought that would be a good trial to, uh, or it'd be a good way to for me to uh, try and improve. I did not find a tundra. I was hoping for one in that shop, but didn't find one. Haven't seen a tundra yet, so. Right, let's get down off of here. Oh, he stuck his nose right into the ground. Look at his eyeball, guys. There we go. <laughs> Up close and personal. Alright. Let's get on the road. Go up here and turn right. Sometimes it's hard to hit that sweet spot. This is a quick map. Yep, right. Then we stay on straight and then we go left. Okay. I missed the turn. Shoot, it was hard to see. Alright, so we'll go back. This thing doesn't exactly turn on a dime. a turn but I don't see a turn I don't see a road let's keep an eye on where okay it's just after this building that's why I didn't see it it's a tiny little road that there was a military up this way. Speaking of nice weapons. Oh shit. <gasps> boy, am I hope I'm, I'm high enough. Oh boy. Okay, here we go. Crap. 
Oh my gosh, that was a pretty one. I, those red ones are really my favorites, I think. Is that it? I'm glad I didn't try to cross that. Because look, there's a little tiny fence there I would not have seen from the car. And uh, I don't think I can fit around this barrier. Maybe I can. But this car is so big. Holy mackerel, guys. Look at the size of this guy. Look at his feet. A holophosaurus. And then, for some reason, the, uh, I don't know where it went, but, uh, probably, it's probably on the ground somewhere. The KAM, uh, glitched. Probably needs a, probably needs to be cleaned. Wow, that was weird. <laughs> Look at his feet. That looks weird. Looks like I had a little bit of a road accident that I'm going to have a little trouble explaining to the AAA. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, let's get around this side. What does that mean? You will leave the... You have left the open fire zone. Not sure what that meant. Maybe I wasn't supposed to shoot him until I got in that zone. Am I in it now? Oh, I'm just on the edge. Well, if any humans are up there, they're going to know I was here for sure. That KAM, though, I don't know where it went. I think it fell through the map. But I had to put it down quick because... Uh, it uh, locked up on me. It jammed. Whoa. The size of those teeth. Oh, I, I get it. I'm right on the edge personally. So I just keep running in and out. Let's see. I don't see the gun underneath the vehicle. So I think we just lost the first thing we found. Darn it. I could have fixed it because I had a a gun cleaning kit, but I, I don't uh, I don't think it went on me anywhere. Oh wait, it did. How did it go on me? Oh, I know. When I picked up the one I have in my hands, it went in, in the slot where it goes. All right. That's what happened. True. I thought it went underneath the, into, into the ground. Alright, so we're going to run up here on our own. I don't know if this is such a great idea. I think we're going to have to try to get the car through here. Um, we can go up the hill a little bit and then come down. Can we get past this guy? Nope. Uh-oh. We're going to give it a try. Boy, I just missed him. Alright, so we're going to go up here. I think we're going to back up. And we're going to go around this apple tree. This way. We want to go, uh, yeah, behind the. We're going to go behind this. These, um, watchies. Coils. There we go. And over this way. 
Boy, this is tough driving, guys. Barely fits. But I do not want to try going up this hill and collecting stuff and trying to carry it back down with dinosaurs and zeds all over the place. This might have been a bad idea because I might not be able to get back out of here, but we're going to give it a try. Yeah, it is a PvP zone. So if anybody is here, they can they can kill me. All right, let's get in and out as quick as we can. Take everything we need. Uh, I'm shooting my own. That sight is off. I want to shoot my own car. Any more of them? Okay, so we got two, three of the two stories. Let's get going. And just pick up everything that is useful. I don't know what that means. Oh shoot, we got so much shit we can't even pick anything up. That was a dump. Should have taken care of that before I got in here. Now I'll get killed for sure just from being stupid. There we go. Alright. Get rid of that as well. I don't need another canteen. Okay, don't need to carry my rope around with me. Alright, now we got some more stuff. Got room for stuff. I don't think I need this M91 revolver. No, I don't need that. That'll take. That's AK ammo. Right, AK-74. <laughs> okay, something else big floating around here. Okay. Forty-five we can use. Definitely use three five fifty-six. Ah, uh, give me that ammo. of uh, boots there. Gotta hate when it does that. There's a, like a little tiny position. Oh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. No, that's an MPK. MP5. That's not the same. I don't want anything that shoots 9 by 19s Oh, <gasps> there we go. I think I just picked up some 9x39s nine nine I don't need. I think this uh, scope is a little bit off. Because I think you have to shoot... It's not the circle that you have to hit. Which is what you think. Oh, there's another one. It's below the circle. That you have to hit. I heard something quite a lot bigger. I think I've been through here. It's a butt stock. Oh no, I did. I did missed some stuff. All right. I don't think I need an M4, but I'll take it. M4 butt stock. Okay. We've been up here. We've been in that one. We haven't been over here. Don't need Mo's and ammo. Boy, it's like really stressful uh, already looting a Millie 
and now you've got Zeds running around, or, or Z and with Zeds running around, but you've also got um, Velociraptors and shit like oh, something bigger than a Velociraptor running around too. It's like really crazy. What on earth is that? Oh, handguard. Where does that go? That's that is the. It's for a G three, right? Oh, G three A three. Okay, I've got I'm G thirty six A three. All right. What is this one? Okay, they're both G thirty six A three. I don't want to be up here any longer than I have to be, but I'm trying to make sure I don't miss it. Oh, another Molly pack. Um, can I wear more than one? No, just one. We like the black better than the tan. It's on our back there. Okay. Let's get out of here. Okay, we did uh, that one, that one, this one. We haven't done this one. Or that one down on the end. Okay. Another helmet, just like mine. Is mine still pristine? It is. be a little bit too uh, much for... Oh, there's an SK. Uh-oh. There's a big fella. Let me get back to the car real quick. I've got to get... Oh, there he is. Another Triceratops. Well, I know it, that they can't hurt me up here. So I'm not too worried as long as I can get on the car. Well, I want to get over to that two-story over there, because I don't think I've been to that one. Uh, but I, w I don't want to stay too long here. I'm getting nervous. For good reason, I think. Oh my god. I hit the mother load, you guys. Another one of those. What I want is a USG 45. I didn't get one. Combat pants. I don't know if I can use that or not. If I can fit it in, I'll take it. Just get out of here quick. Okay. Uh, seems quiet. Triceratops is not charging. Put everything in here real quick. Get the flock out of town. There we go. I can put that there. Put that in here. We'll just put everything in here. We'll deal with it later. Forty-five. Yeah, we're not using those right now. That's everything that we don't need right now. And uh, let's just grab this thing. 
get it cleaned real quick. Nope, let's do that somewhere else. Let's not be stupid. Okay, Vanderkill, thank you so much for coming in and thank you for whoop, for uh, hanging with me. I hope you have a great day or evening and I will catch up with you another time. Now I gotta figure out how to get out of here. Because there's no... I think there's no other way out. Where else do I want to go? It's getting pretty late, so probably I should go somewhere and just park. Where's going to be the easiest place to go? Probably over to Guglova. That's going to be pretty straightforward. I just got to get down out of here and that's going to be interesting because I'm parked face into the <laughs> place and I have to try to turn around. This is going to be interesting. I have to do like a 16 pointer turn. Oh, yeah, I'm not really gonna. Let me see. Can I go th straight through that? Or? No, I can't. Okay. Yep, it's going to be like a 16-pointer turn, that's for sure. Now is the time for somebody to rock up and <laughs> pick me off. Okay, now we got to get out of here. Do we think there are fences all around? Probably. Try for it? Yes. There's got to be a place where there's no fence. There's one. Alright. Now we're going back down the hill. going. We're going the wrong way. Okay, what's up this way? <laughs> I think Delina is looking pretty good for the night, guys. Where else can we go? Let's zoom out a little. Yep, we can go up to Delina. Or down to Solichny. Solnich Solnichi. Um Well we'll get as far as Delina and see how, how that goes. Just get out of here. Get out of the um red zone. That was the red uh this should come up to a better road here. Not too far. This sucker picks up a lot of speed going downhill, I'll tell you that. I hope I didn't wreck it. There we go, back onto the road.
Boy, this is a tough road. You get rolling really fast. Oh, there we go. There's a good road up ahead. All right, we made it out of there. Oops, almost. All right, let's see. We can do it. We can get up that hill. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. There we go. Boy, these roads are so tight up in here, too. And the, uh... There we go. Get my viewpoint a little bit more straightforward. Here we go. I think this is Delina up here. Yeah, I've been here before. There's a police station. Whoa, slow down, slow down, slow down. All right, now. I think there's a, there's a little place off to the side yeah, I just missed the turn. So we just go back up. Just a little tiny bit past this police station. There's our turn. So it's really hard to see when you're driving. You can't turn, if you turn your head, your view, you just crash into shit. here. I'm pretty tired and it's about two o'clock in the morning for me. Oh, we got friends coming to visit. I think I'm going to hop out and uh, take care of these guys. the one. Alright, now, take care of my person. Hopefully, get a little something to eat here. And then we can uh, kind of take a look at the town uh, tomorrow, or, or maybe the next day. Alright, guys. That's pretty good. My person is taken care of. Everything's pretty locked and loaded. We're ready for any trouble. Let's go ahead and find someone to uh, to raid to. Let's see who's on. Melting side is on, and uh, he does a he's really a great guy. I really enjoy uh, listening to him and watching him play. So let's go and raid the underscore melting side. So if you can hang with me just for a minute so we can get that raided, I appreciate it. Let him know where you came from. And thank you so much for coming in tonight, guys, and for hanging with me while I, I'm learning how to shoot from the hip. 
and trying to do a better job of not dying. There we go. And we'll see you guys over the course of this next week. Um, and like I said, I very much appreciate you hanging with me. And the, for the raids and the follows and the subs, you guys have a great night. And thank you very much. Good night.